I'm eating a tomato sandwich today, and it's great! And I'm about to play Psychonauts. Fifteen moths, hello, I am excited for psychic noughts. Yes, I am psyched for Psychonauts, you could say. That's my funny joke for a cool streamer. Ten. Just like Ryze himself. Bonus BB Holly Tones Bonus BB Holly Tones Bonus BB Psych of Knots Holly Tones Bonus BB I, I just got off work copy and pasting images for free Horus. Brain time. Another hard day's work in the Google Images Mines. Okay, we are here, and wow are these graphics sure are stunning. of supporting Holly's good good streams.
while busy I had surgery a week or so ago, but I finally have time to pop in for a stream. some psychonauts and collect some pigments.
so ready to get my brain tumbled. How's everyone doing today? Hope you've been having a good one. And if things haven't been so great, then hopefully stream tonight can give you somewhere nice to be for a little bit. It is Wednesday. It is Wednesday, right? We're Wednesday. I'm pretty sure we're Wednesday. We're Wednesday. Uh, August 4th, 2021. Uh, I slept like a fucking rock last night, even though I went to bed late. Uh, so I ended up waking up late, and so my entire day was 
kind of a mad dash to do get everything done in time for stream. <laughs> <clears throat> I made a tomato sandwich for dinner. Minche KA Blue for the six month resub. Six smile hi Holly, thank you for playing one of my fave games ever. It is so fun to watch you play it. Oh hell yeah, glad you're enjoying. <clears throat> I made a tomato sandwich for dinner because it's my favorite season of the year. Uh, the season where the fresh tomatoes come in. Uh, and I get to eat fucking great tomatoes. More or less whenever I want. <laughs> so, I'm taking advantage of that. I just took like a whole tomato, sliced it up, toast up some bread. Uh, I like a bit of mayo on there. I put a, a slice of bacon that I had chopped up. Uh, a bit of cheese that I had gotten from a, a local-ish cheese-making place. Uh, tomato. A bit of salt and pepper. Good stuff, good stuff. Uh, and so that was nice. <clears throat> uh, I probably should have tried to eat it a little before stream because now I feel like I've got like a... Like a frog in the back of my throat, as it were. <laughs> It'll probably go away, but... You know when, like, it's right after you eat something and there's, like, a weird feeling in the back of your throat for a little bit? <clears throat> Holly Jones with Biz can't wait to become a secret agent at age 10. I don't think that's how it works, but <laughs> thank you for the nine-month resub. I appreciate it. Uh, was there anything else I wanted to say? I'm... gay. And we're gonna play some Psychonauts today. A <laughs> uh, couple hours. Ideally, I'd like to do a few. Uh, I was telling myself last time, man, I feel so bad, I didn't get to do like a long stream last time, and I looked at the VOD and it was like, what, four hours? Which seems pretty sizable, so probably gonna aim for something kind of like that today. Uh, I suppose that's it, aside from the, the normal pre-stream stuff, you know, if you, if you like the streams, you want to support what we do here, uh, subs, tips, bits. All that stuff, uh, never mandatory, don't feel obligated to, but any and all support like that is very greatly appreciated. Uh, this is my main source of income, uh, and I'm able to, you know, do this and other creative projects uh, as often as I do, uh, thanks to the generosity of viewers like you at home. Uh, so, you know, I'm able to, to, to do stuff like this and also be able to pay bills and buy food and all that, so thank you all very much for your very generous support, I appreciate it. Thank you, Ham Salad Kitty, for the four month resub. That's a hell of a name. <laughs> I'm so full of excitement for Epic Streamer. Thank you. I'm so full from excitement! Yum! <laughs> uh, if you're looking for, you know, some other way to support the stream that costs you nothing, you can always share posts on uh, Twitter about the streams. You can tell friends about the stream, stuff like that. Uh, and you can tune in. You know, if you like what we're doing here, you got the time, you got the energy, stopping on by, having a nice time. That counts as support in a way, so thank you all so much for taking time out of your busy day to spend it here with us. Uh, if you want to uh, join the Discord, exclamation point Discord, there's a link to that, info about it. There's a nice little community there. Nice folks. Thank you, Big Toss. For the five gift subs, that's awful generous of you. I appreciate it. Uh, if you want to submit fan art, uh, either post it in the Discord or at me on Twitter with it. Um, if you want to see uh, a special guy, we have a special guy channel. Uh, in the Discord for you. Check it out. <laughs> uh, 
I think that's about everything I wanted to say. Oh yeah, uh, bit a bit of an off week this week. No streams uh, scheduled aside from like Sunday morning for a couple of hours because uh, I need to get some like behind the scenes stuff uh, sorted out before we uh, get rolling with the, the, the Minecraft project thing. Thank you, uh, Distracted Doodler, for the two gift subs. That's very generous of you. I really appreciate that. Uh, and also, I have other stuff unrelated to streams that I have to do, so... <laughs> uh, unless I, like, have some time in, like, an evening, in which case we'll probably do another another puzzle game. That might be fun. All that said, uh, I think we're ready to start? I think we're ready to start. I probably should set up a, a sludge command, shouldn't I? Can I watch the camping game while camping? Inception with weenies. Yo, have fun camping. I miss camping. Thank you for the bits, I appreciate it. Uh, let's... boot up yonder video game. I guess it helps if I have Steam open, doesn't it? Uh... Psychonauts? It's this one. I will press play now. Please, Steam. Please, Steam. Please, please. Steam, please. Please, Steam. Please. It's gonna be loud, by the way. Um... What? My name is Raz. I jump with A button. That's his famous quote. I had a weird dream that started out as a cool dream, then it turned into a scary dream, and I don't have enough characters to tell you the details, but when I woke up, I was glad I was up in time for this and didn't miss Psychonauts. Can we do a can we do a brain trick? Also I think a big challenge is Dan for the tip. Can I catapult Raz into orbit? Is this like a Mario Galaxy type beat? game. We're gonna continue.
Rasputin, please, germs. Rasputin, please, germs. Rasputin, please, germs. Is it normal that the camera is just spinning slightly on its own? It stopped. scares the kids off. Ha! Well, not me. I'm ready to kill for my camp. Listen, I'm sorry, but I can't train you. Agent Vodello would kill me. What's the big deal? What she doesn't know won't hurt her. You don't even have a marksmanship learner's permit. I could lose my job. I'll get one. Even if you used that secret passage over there and snuck into his sanctuary, Agent Cruller would never give you a marksmanship learner's permit. Agent Cruller? Never in a million. I'm off. Be right back after I talk with Agent Cruller. Oh, I didn't think you would seriously want to do the combat training. I, I was just fucking with you, kid. I just wanted you to go away. Whoops. Holly tones love. Holly tones love. Holly tones <laughs> love. Holly tones love. Holly tones love. Thank you, pseudonym Jones, for the four month resub. I really appreciate that. I hope you're doing well. Uh, let's go to see. Let's go to Fort Cruller. I mean, my sanctuary. Yes, noble psycho master. All right, we're back here. Agent Cruller? Charm, how goes the training? Uh, I need to learn how to fight better. Sasha says I need to learn how to fight better. You want to teach you advanced combat? On your first day? Yeah. I had a vision with a huge monster with yellow eyes and a big mouthful of gnashing teeth. Did it happen to spit anything at you? Yeah. I think it was like an old dining helmet or something. I see. Hmm. Yes, well, we'd better get you armed. Why? What's happening? Nothing, nothing. Prepare your mind. <laughs> That's the motto of the Psychonauts. Here, this is a marksmanship learner's permit. It will only work when you're in Sasha's mind. Once you complete his shooting range, you'll get the real merit badge and you can side blast anywhere you want. Thanks. Side blast? Oh, you'll find out. Now get going. We can't have the camp overrun with big eyed garbage spitting monsters, can we? No, sir. Hey, you didn't have some kind of weird creature come into your brainscape and spit stuff at you, right? No kind of goalie that was spitting old diving equipment at you? Well, actually, I did. Does that mean something? Nope, nothing at all, kid. Now you skedaddle. <laughs> I love these guys. Uh, I've already asked these ones, so I guess I'll just skedaddle for now. I better go. Lots of work to do. Good luck, Rasputin. Which ways was it? It was this ways. Oh, there might be like a bit of drift on my pro controller, actually, huh? Nope, now it's not doing it anymore. Maybe the camera in this game just is weird. Where would you like me to take you, Agent Crawler? Holly, you're getting closer every day to being able to voice everyone in this game, and it fills me with both immense pride and respect and also deep fear. Good. <laughs> Bring me near the geodesic psycho-isolation chamber. Roger that, Ranger Crawler. peeking into a hole in the girl's cab then I'm hiding and I thought <laughs> I 
<laughs> Thank you, Scribbler Sis, for the resub. Hey, Lily. Going for the advanced training? What's the rush? Are you kidding? I only have a few days to become a psychonaut or I lose my shot forever. Look, Raz. I hate to burst your bubble, but the psychonauts are not what they used to be. Times have changed. The world just doesn't need us anymore. The world does too need psychonauts. Right here at this very camp, in fact. I think there are several fishy things that need psychic investigation. You are so immature and cute. What are you gonna just shut Jesus. up and me? Shut up and do what? Oh, I didn't know you could. Uh, I gotta go. Bye. So embarrassing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Last stream, I mistakenly said David K voiced Verix and I was ashamed. Verix is in fact voiced by D. Bradley Big. Oh, don't worry, I figured that out too. Rex from STRWRS, Cinnamon Bun from Us, and Almond from Legends of the Hidden Temple Smile. Yeah, I, I ended up looking that up and I was like, Ah, son of a bitch, I was tricked! I mean, I get names mixed up all the time, so it's fine. <laughs> Thank you for the tip, though, I appreciate it. There we go. Hey, we can get another challenge marker. Thank you, Dandy Pansy. Hello, Holly. I haven't seen a stream in many years, but I'm excited to be back. Hell yeah, months. Hell yeah! Thanks for tuning in. This doesn't do anything helpful right in this specific spot, but it is fun, so. <laughs> I still got it. Thank you, Duke of Hammer, for the 15 months. So happy you're playing this game. It's one of my favorites. I'm liking it a hell of a lot so far myself. Rasputin, please. Germ. I don't want to crack open these smelling salts unless I'm in a mental world. Rasputin, and I really, really please. want to get out. Germs. They smell pretty bad. Okay, I got it. Check it out. Excellent. Well, my ass is covered. Are you sure you are ready <laughs> to do this? It could be dangerous. I do like how Sasha's gone from like, I mean, I was just telling you this because usually it scares the kids away and it gets them to leave me alone, to just being like, oh, fuck yeah, okay, you're down for business then. <laughs> yes. Are you going to pull me into your mind like the coach did? Hmm. No offense, but it's time you saw what an organized mind looks like. Little goggles animation is cool. In we go. Welcome to my mind. Huh. It's so empty. Uh, I mean, there's more here than meets the eye, but I've learned to keep it under strict control, and that's what I'm going to teach you. Control your feelings, your fears, your anger. You must learn to control them, focus them, concentrate them, and release them. As therapy? No, as firepower. Say something hideous and horrible jumps out at you. Something so disgusting that it simply must die. Ah, oh, so tacky. I can't look directly at it. <laughs> but I control those feelings. Focus them, concentrate, and release. And the world is a better place. Your turn. I do like this dude. Just straight up being like, Welcome to my twisted mind, Rasputin. I compartmentalize and repress everything. It's fucking awesome and I'm so healthy. You can do it too. Well done, Raz. Keep shooting. Well done, Raz. Keep shooting. Excellent. A victory for good taste. Now you must strive for precision when targeting. Say you were set upon by multiple attackers. But you need to dispense with them in a certain order. Eliminate these monsters in the proper sequence, and we can move on to the next lesson. Oh. 
I don't have the feather in here. Damn it. Good shooting, Raz, Seven but you are making it harder oh, yeah. than it needs to be. Oh, yeah. You need to practice oh, locking yeah. your mental focus. It makes targeting and evasive maneuvers much easier. Let's try again. This time, lock your mental focus. Ah. Holding L to switch targets, I see. Rasputin, it's time to teach you about Z targeting. Good. Again. Good. Again. Good. Again. No. Is this what oh, you saw? Oh, is that too much, Putin? I've been stuck in disbrain for like a month trying to crack a case. But hey, at least in this world I ain't the size of a tortellini so it ain't all bad. I forgot oh, last yeah. time I muted the alerts so that like people wouldn't keep talking over them while I was listening to dialogue. Thank you for the tip, though. Uh, I'm probably going to have this muted for a while. I would, I would like to listen to the talking. Your vision? Um, well, it sure seemed a lot bigger in my head. Ah, problems often seem larger in our heads than they really are. That's an important lesson to learn. But This is a sensor, an integral part of any sane person's mind. The sensors roam through your psyche, looking for thoughts that don't belong. Hallucinations, manias, waking dreams. The sensors hunt them down and censor them out. Why do they come after me? I'm not a mania. Yes, but you are a foreign entity in my mind. You technically don't belong here. Yes, but I was attacked in my own head. Yes, well, the brain tumbler could be malfunctioning, or you could be insane. We'll test for that later. For now, <laughs> blast it. Ah, the white blood cells of the human mind. That's the spirit. I killed it. It was just a thought I was having, and it's not dead. It has just returned to its basic form, raw psychic energy. Go absorb it. It's good for your mental health. Yep. I love absorbing. As you absorb this energy, your mental health increases. But as you psi blast, you expend your will to do damage. So be on the lookout for these small, dense clusters of raw psychic aggression. Absorb these as well to make sure you always have enough firepower. Now I'll leave the machine on for you so you can practice. You have to blast 1,000 sensors to earn your marksmanship merit badge. Come back every day for practice, and you should have enough in as little as three weeks. Three weeks? I only have a few days to earn all my merit badges and become a psychonaut. Slow and steady wins the race, my eager young friend. Now practice, slowly and carefully. Oh, man. We're gonna end up not doing that somehow, aren't we? Let's see. Hmm. Ah, the goodies that keep running away from me. I want them. This is gonna take forever. I wonder if I can speed it up somehow. Ah, now we're gonna go for the machine. Right? Or maybe this here? I do like these little guys just going around, just going like, no, 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 no. I wonder what would happen if I turned that dial up. Ah, that button. Whoop. Hey. You skedaddle. Hmm. They're coming out faster, but still not fast enough. Okay, let's do that again. Still not fast enough. A more? Still not fast enough. What if it was faster? Still not fast enough. What if it was faster? Hmm. 
Still not fast enough. Okay, what if we made it faster? Skull is the highest number I know, so this has got to be good. Done. This is not control. This is chaos. I'll try to fix it. You stay here and keep the numbers under control. Bro, you dunked up my brain. Something awful. I was using that to have thoughts and ideas. Now I will be ashamed of my words and deeds. I do like the music here, though. Let me guess, we can jump to the side of the cube. There we go. This is just Mario's game. It's funny, they don't seem to let you do the double jump once you're... Oh, never mind, I just did it wrong then. Sputin. See those valves? That is where the sensors are leaking out. Psy blast the valves to shut them down and get this area under control. Oh, they ripped them to like chunks when you beat them. I just noticed. All right, we don't have to call the web yet. The steamer trunk is running around. It needs help. Let's see, this is for a buffer bag. Wait, no, you're not the trunk. You're the you're the safe. I can just hit you. Get back in here. Sasha's first loss. Lots of goodies to grab here, aren't there? There we go. Watch it. Yes! I would literally do anything to see this animation every day of my life. Yeah, these guys have some good explosions. Some real good ones. From the top rope. What's this? Is this another life? Oh. Uh, I guess I'm already full up on lives. Projection depth is a fun way of naming that mechanic. Basically, all the projections here. Let's go shooting target. Uh, you side blast to shut down the valve. <laughs> that man just stood in front of me. Like, hey, what's up? 
Hey, mean to me. Let's go pick up some goodies. I love picking up goodies. Every day of my life, I'm waking up, I'm touching goodies, I'm feeling great. Here's something. Good thing I didn't fall, I guess. On this side. Let me guess, there's gonna be more. Who would have thought the guy that was suppressing everything is having all his suppressed thoughts come out? <laughs> Who could have seen it coming? Oh no, you close one leak down and another springs up. Well, come on, we've got to take care of these too. Okay. Uh, well, if I know anything about 3D platformer collectibles games, it's that there's probably going to be secrets on these other face sides. I might as well give them a quick check just to be sure. Otherwise, that's going to eat away at me forever. Nothing immediately visible. Nothing over here, it looks like. But there might be something later. So... Damn, Bigman takes two shots. Give me the blasts, give me the juice. right by me like it was nothing. Hi! Happy. Okay, I suppose we just go back here. Blast ammo, please, please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, there's probably some other way around to get there. For a bit before he remembered he had to blow up. Okay. Oh, that just makes us go away. Damn. Ah, well. I always come back another time. A lot of 
bugs in these ones. All right, let's see some goodies. Show me some goodies. Hi! Get back here, you animal. Get back here! Oh, I have to punch it. Okay. Open up! Sasha's second sight. Jeez. <laughs> I feel like knowing that this man got so embarrassed about hearing about his mom having a boob once that he ran away from home explains a lot. And yes, that's reductive, but, you know. This guy's exploding. There we go, that's ammo. Oh, that piece of ammo's dead. Up we go. The little exploding guys are cute. I like their design. Oh god, they jump! They jump up here! Oh no! Mostly just want to be in. Let's see. This. That's uh, cobwebs. Can we jump up there? It looks like no. Okay. Oh, we're low on health, aren't we? Hmm. Oh. Yeah, I guess if you hit them when they're close to you, they blow up on you, don't they? I thought I was targeting a farther one. <laughs> Every time you lose all your mental health, you peel off a layer of your astral projection. If you lose all the layers, then you will no longer be able to maintain a projection in this mental world, and you'll be kicked out to the real one. Collect markers like this to replace layers, and collect markers like this to increase how many layers you can maintain at once. Okay, so there's, like, one-up mushroom, and then there's max number of lives possible mushroom. Sort of thing. Is there anything else still up here? I don't think we can go up there quite yet, so... At least not from this part. I'll just check back here. Just the web, it looks like. Cool, they don't know how to use ladders. Little fools. You good, bud? Yes. No. 
Oh, okay. Time to go back! Oh, now we gotta go back there and it's okay. Oh, I haven't been looking at the chat. Are people being weird about something? What's what's going on? Oh, right, I gotta not do that. <laughs> Close by! There we go. Very normal in the brain today. Is this going to be a recurring theme of like, uh, Rasputin goes into someone's brain and he's just kind of like, wow, you really need a therapist. I like the like, eruption of yeses in the chat. <laughs> All right. And remember when they blow up, they blow up near you, and it hurts you. Let's get healing. Let's get help. noticed uh, the tip that just happened. Thank you, January, for that. I'll take a look at what that said later, I suppose. There we go. If I can target the blow up you guys, that just kind of makes that a lot easier. like three punches to take these guys out, but only um, two brain blasts. So I'm guessing the blast is stronger, just in general? Unless it's just specific to these guys? Who knows? I don't know. This one looks like it's made of meat. I just, like, got out of a cutscene and now there's three guys just attacking me! <laughs> and I got, like, an achievement and a loud sound? So, is there anything else over here about I can grab that I can notice? Uh, nah. Okay, let's show them our beam. Blocked off all of Sasha's sensor outlets. I can't wait to tell him. Young man, I hope you have learned a lesson here today. Yes, I have. That shooting things is fun and useful. No, that once you lose control <laughs> of your own mind, it's very hard to get it back. Yes, one's thoughts must be 100% controlled at all times. Well, no. Actually, if you try to completely suppress your undesirable feelings, they'll build and build and eventually explode. Okay, yeah, I'm glad he's acknowledging so, that. Uh, what would happen if you were to say completely block off all your sensor outlets? Well, uh -oh. there would be a buildup of sensor energy within that would uh, eventually run Rasputin very fast. <laughs> Oh, hey, 
पर यू आर माई ओन क्रिएशन आई कमेंड यू टू स्टॉप That was very loud all of a sudden. When your mental focus is locked, press A and use left stick in any direction. Very useful. For... Oh, that's a dodge roll, isn't it? Uh... There we go. I stopped targeting up. Okay. Enough horseplay, Rasputin. Destroy him. I, 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 I. I hit the wrong button. I'm not used to there being a dodge roll in this now. Small sensors are feeding into his strength. You must stop them. Okay, let's get the new counts. Put me down. Enough. One or two. All right, the little guys. They're still there. They're still hurting. This dude's throwing meatballs at me. Y yes, game, I know about the mechanic. I'm trying to kill the little guys so that I can get other things. It's fine. You don't have to keep telling me. <laughs> Excellent. You've shut down the valve so he cannot be rejuvenated. Now destroy him. I like the like plunger sound it makes when you pop off. No, nope, let me target. Let me let me target. Watch it. Ow. Let me get goodies. Let me get goodies. Thank you. to deal with, like, a lot of little guys all at once. And they're all just rushing at you like this. I guess there is some AoE with the jump hit, so... Oh, wait, no, he was, like, one hit away from dying. I should have just done that. <laughs> I didn't so, realize. is this where I get a speech and learn another lesson? No, here's your merit badge. Let us never speak of this again. So this is like an important teachable lesson, right? No, get the fuck out of my brain. <laughs> A victory for good taste. I want to shoot more things. Okay, okay, enough about my mind. Let's stay out of my mind for a while. Let's just go back into yours, huh? Step up to the brain tumbler when you're ready. All right, it's time for tumbling. Uh, although. Rasputin, please. Germs. Rasputin, please. Germs. Rasputin, please. Germs. Bro, check it out. Delicious. Hey, looks like you're ready to take on a new psychic power. Ready to come back and get your new merit badge? Yeah. Yes. Alrighty then. If you keep getting oh, if you keep getting hit by the big stamp, Sasha will eventually stop giving hints and say, "My name is Jon Jonsson. I live in Wisconsin. I work in a lumberyard there." Good. 
hard work, dedication, and mental agility. I'm proud to bestow upon you the official merit badge for telekinesis. Oh? It's big hand mode. With telekinesis, we can use our minds to grasp an object and then throw it. Go ahead, try it yourself. Ah, the clown bin. The wretched clown bin. Oops, wrong button. Yes. Now, when you've chosen your destination, throw it. Oh, <laughs> good throw. Now, <laughs> let's see if you can make it through the hoop. You sound like my dad. Hey, I've been thinking about that. Why'd that guy hate psychics so much? What do we ever do to him? Well, psychics killed his whole family. Cursed them and all their descendants to die in water. Uh-oh. Whoa. Yeah. Talk about baggage. Tell me about it. And the weird thing is, I'm pretty sure he's actually psychic himself. Hmm. Ha! Cuckoo! Well, you can work on him when you get home. For now. Oops. Sounds like a weird mix of wanting to protect your family and also projection. Good thing there's no water level in this game, right? Oh, great shot. Let's see you do that again. Smiles. <laughs> now, try to throw that baby right through the hoop. Bingo! Okay, last one. Just smiles at the camera looking Come directly on. into it. <laughs> show you something. Pick that trash can up and aim your toss at the side of the caravan. I don't actually know if there's a water level, but like, 3D platformers tend to have one, so... <laughs> the side of the caravan. Kablooey! Throwing something against a wall is a little more destructive than tossing it around on the ground, isn't it? Oh no! Another one of my senses! Now how'd that get in here? Looks like we're in luck. He doesn't see you yet. Why don't you smash him on the head with that handy trash can? Come on! Use telekinesis to pick up the trash can and throw it at that sensor. Sure is messed up how an intrusive thought got in here, isn't it? Wonder how that happened. Well, nothing to it. Might as well beat his ass. <laughs> Bye! Looks like the trash took him out. <laughs> Next lesson, we'll work on your snappy one-liners. Agent Cruller? Sure. How goes the training? Ready to go back? Actually, I no. better go. Lots of work to do. Talk to me when you want me to put you back where you were. Good luck, Rasputin. Oh, that's handy that it just lets you talk to him and be like, okay, put me back wherever the fuck I just was. I was worried I'd have to go back the long way. Uh, Ford said that I can use this machine to turn pine needles into delicious tap. I said it turns mental cobwebs into side cards. Just testing your hearing. <laughs> but you gotta buy a cobweb duster at the camp store first. Yeah, yeah. Why don't you yeah, yeah me? Man, he's like a little bat. Bat your head in, punk. <laughs> I love Crawler. Love how starkly upfront Raz is about his trauma compared to the other camp goers. I mean... I feel like there's, like, a level of trust here where it's like, oh, okay, well, like, Agent Cruller is, like, running, uh, the, the, the whole operation, and he was, like, a super influential, super, like, good at his job, famous psychonaut, and also he's here to, like, help me specifically. He's one of the few people that, without question, was just kind of like, yeah, kid, I believe in you. I think you're gonna do great out there. So, like, it, it makes sense that Raz is like, well, I don't really have any reason to hide this from this guy, like... This is the closest this kid is going to get to, like, a licensed accredited therapist, uh, at this camp. <laughs> and given how Agent Nine's brain was, I think maybe quite a few people ought to take advantage of that. <laughs> I still need to buy a Psycor in the camp store before I can use this Oh, machine. right, I gotta buy one of those. Ones. Okay. Uh, hang on, what happened? People are talking about...
the super player feature. Oh, do you mean on the the Twitter? Yeah, uh, I I like. I know the person who runs uh, the, the 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 double fine psychonauts Twitter stuff. We're 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 acquaintances. <laughs> so yes, I did see it. To training. I kind of don't want to leave this area because I really like this song. Yeah, Heather's fucking dope. She rules. Okay, teleport me back, people. I'm ready to go back into the field. Okay, let's see if I remember exactly where you were. Uh, Agent Crawler, you, you you put me up. You put me way up. <laughs> Spitting personal demons. That's the spirit. I mean, if I can shoot beams at someone else's trauma, why can't I do it at my own, huh? Oh, I just. <laughs> I just left. I just. <laughs> this truly is the Tumblr.com experience. You log in, you look at it for two seconds. You log out. Okay. Time to face my big diving helmet spitting personal demons. That's the spirit. <laughs> you turn 360 degrees and walk out of your own head. Sasha shooting gallery. What do these little symbols mean? Oh! Does that mean we still have things to find in here? Or does it- no, 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 wait, no, so... I see, so... The glowing means that we found all of that thing. So, like, the glowing means we found all the safes, that means we found all the, the steamer trunks and, and baggage. Uh, this means we need to find all the cobwebs and all the figments. Okay, I get it, I get it. I'm learning, I'm understanding game mechanics. This is... Something. We've been to. That's probably uh, what's his name's head at the tutorial. And this is the brain tumbler experiment. So let's do that. Oh, are people trying to backseat? Uh, I I I think there are some mods around. You can just like straight up timeout people or ban them for that. I don't care. <laughs> If they're not going to listen to the rules. Little rabbit! Hey. It's good to see my friend teleport options again, too. Hey, buddy. My good friend the meat. My good friend the meat. Awesome. The little teleport options creature's name is Oatmeal? No, it's teleport options. I can't go through here. Ah, there we go, that's why. Well, that was remarkably easy. Okay, that's just funny dishes. Oatmeal is what I just do in the morning when I'm hungry. This gives me money if I just slap the meat repeatedly. Hey, where'd it go? Don't tell me I imagined that whole thing. Ah, there you are. Gotta grab these goodies. Oh, that's a good-looking bird. Oh, that's a fun bird. That is a bird, right? 
I'm assuming that's bird. It seems bird-like. Watch those. Uh, that's a cyclone. Creation, I command you to stop. Dang. Never Bro, why are you sad? It's okay. It's fine. It's awesome. See? Love that little shaking sound. Just for fun. Oh, right, I can't punch in midair, so I can't get those. Hey! Nasty plant. Out of here. That music plays in your real life whenever you find cathartic closure? I wish it would play for me in real life when I, like. I don't know. Finish washing the dishes, get off the toilet, really mundane stuff like that. Explosive sensors are referred to as personal demons. That's fun. <laughs> See, I like when people tell me stuff like that, not stuff like, Oh, you're missing something! Go back and get it! It's fine. I don't care. I can replay levels. I don't have to get everything in the video game. It's fine if I miss stuff. But, like, if it's just stuff like, Oh, like, here's a fun fact that, like, you probably wouldn't have been able to find otherwise unless you, like, read stuff, then it's like, yeah, that's cool. I like that stuff. It's fine if I don't play the game the same way as you did once, though. I did really like the, the couple screenshots and stuff of, like, enemies in the sequel that I saw. If, if like, the bits of this game I've played so far are anything to go by, Psychonauts 2 is gonna be a wild fucking ride. I am, as they say, looking forward to it. Suitcase tag. Leave me alone. Bless you. Where's that quiet coming from? Oh, right, I can do first person. It's up there, isn't it? Goodies. Oh, was the sequel out in three weeks? Wow. It's sooner than I thought. One of the biggest inspirations for this game was Rayman 2. Oh, god, yeah, I can totally see that. I adored Rayman 2 as a kid. Oh, that's a really good platformer. At least I thought it was when I first played it. Uh, I've not played it in years, so I don't know if it holds up any. You know, sometimes you play a game as a kid and you think, Man, this is the greatest thing since Swiss cheese. This is the greatest thing since sliced bread. Uh, I want to do everything that's like this. And then uh, you experience it when you're older and you're just kind of like... Eh, huh, hmm. Hopefully it's still good, though. Confirmed to still own? Fuck yeah. That's the good shit you love to hear. I want to get back on top, on top here. How did I how did I do that last time? And there we go. Your grandpa is older than sliced bread. Cool. Hey! I've never thought about when sliced bread was first invented or released. Is that the right word for it? I feel like then I'm just talking about bread in video game or like movie terms, which is funny as a concept to me. Where was the bit that I was on? Is there anything over there about? Yeah, there's some goodies over there. 
I fell. Let's try and do that again. Bird, bird, bird. Ah, the bird is gone. Where was that rock I was using to crime my way up there? Oh, got myself way turned around. This is the start of the level. Okay, I'm going the wrong way. But I did get the bird back, so... That's cool. There's a bit of meat here that I missed. Here's another bird. Please, please, please! You're nothing. Okay. continue just playing the level where it wants me to go, but, uh... I haven't played a 3D platformer in a long time, and my instinct to just jump around everywhere like a nuisance is taking over. Okay. Um... Gotta be some way to silly my way on over. Although maybe we just get there from some other point in the level. So it's just a couple figments anyways. And I'm not going to be getting all those anytime soon, I reckon. Uh, oh, can I jump down? Just like... It doesn't let me go over there. Okay. Bird! Bird! No! The bush! Every time! The bush! <laughs> I'm just going to keep going the normal way. Yeah, it might also just be a case of, like, come back when you have different powers later. <laughs> this one looks so much like meat. I can't remember the last time I played, like, a collectathon and felt super keen on it. Uh, aside from, like, maybe, like, a Mario game or something, but... I feel like that's maybe stretching the definition of what a collectathon is to me, given how, it's, like, you kind of just collect the stars. To me, collectathon is you have a lot of goodies to collect. Like, like, you know, in this one we got the figments, we got the cobwebs, we got the the baggage, all that stuff. Stop on. No, you go away! You go away! <laughs> no, 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 thank you. I should probably try and get some of those, those dusters. I don't remember what level I had to be for those, but... Levels seem to be coming pretty fast, so... Odyssey is fairly close to, like, what uh, a collectathon consists of in, in my head, given how it's got, like, the the, the, the moons, and it's got the, the outfits, and it's got the, the purple coins, and the purple coins are used for more than just moons and outfits. Well, that's also a thing that they do, so it's like... Show these guys up? From far away this time? Because, like, in, in, in most Mario games, it's just kind of like, well, you've got uh, your your stars or your, your shines or what have you. And it's like, well, what do the other collectibles do? You get 100 coins? Well, that gets you a star. You get 8 red coins? That gets you a star. You get blue coins? That gets you either normal coins or a star. <laughs> so... In in my head, collectathon is something like uh, like a D say D say DK sixty four, where it's like uh, hang on, weird me, weird me, weird me. Or is this like a seed or something? 
probably need some kind of glide ability to take advantage of this. It's a very fleshy seed if it is one. So, so like a, a, a DK64 or, or a Banjo-Kazooie, but I've never played a Banjo-Kazooie. It's got like a bunch of different goodies to collect that all do different things that aren't just like you collect the main goodie that progresses the story. I am sorry to say that you have a very serious mental problem. The trouble originates in this area, here. The area that we in the medical profession like to refer to as the brain. You see, son, it's just no good. I hate to be so blunt, but you have the insanity of a manatee. I know. People are always saying that. What do you think's wrong with my brain, doctor? Well, how should I know? I'm a dentist. <laughs> but here's what I do know. If a tooth is bad, you pull it. But my teeth are fine. Yep. Mad brain's got to come out, boy. It's the quickest way to cure what you've got. Insanity of the mind! But I don't wanna... Sh -sh 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 -sh. Now hold still. This will only hurt until your brains come flying out. Uh, uh, get back! No! Don't worry, Dogen. I'm coming up there to save you. What is wrong, Rasputin? No time to explain, Sasha. I gotta claim the spooky thorn tower. I mean, there's probably gonna be time to explain, given how I'm gonna take a while to go look for like collectibles and stuff so you might as you might as well tell them <laughs> you might as well tell them Rez. come on ooh a goodie ooh a goodie ooh and a slappable goodie too get back here let's head him off at the pass come on we're close we're close The world shall taste my eggs. Bird. Fish. Friends. The circus. Awesome. Okay, what the hell was that? I'm seeing some crazy stuff in here, Sasha. This can't be right. Ugh, why did I buy the cheap brain tumbler? <laughs> Fun. Raz is allowed to say hell, I think. He's what? Uh. How old is he? Ten? I think ten? I think ten year olds are allowed to say hell. Also, I did like, uh, uh, I, I know that, 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 that dentist dude is named, like, Lobato because he's a Lobato, Loboticist, Lobotomizer, whatever, what have you. I do like whenever he showed up, like, immediately everyone in chat was just like, ah, it's you, ah, it's him. What was that symbol that just appeared on my screen? That was just a shape on my screen, what, what did, what did that, what did that mean? <laughs> What did that mean? <laughs> oh, it's all the baggage. Okay. Nice. It just kind of appeared and didn't have any text, and I was like, is that... Is, is that normal? Is that fine? We have a vault in our journal. Uh... Where's that? Where would, where would that be? Uh, memories. Would that be selfie a brain tumbler? Oh, there we go. Feel real, primal memories. Oh, it's concept art! Oh, that's cool. It's this guy. The Nightmare Tower. Uh, that's a bathtub. That's a scary object. That's probably a boss that we're gonna have to fight later, isn't it? There's the cutscenes here.
great haul. These two. I do like the sort of, like, dichotomy uh, between their designs of, like, Sasha having a lot of, like, hard, angled edges, and then Milia having a lot more, like, rounded shapes and patterns on her, her outfit. It's cool. Cube! Cool. We got this one as well. Her name is pronounced like Mia. Okay, thank you. Joliander. The camp. This guy. Man, this guy likes to talk a lot of shit, but like at the end of the day, uh, at least my fucking name isn't Bobby Zilch. My parents didn't name me that. Or I guess didn't name Raz that. <laughs> the Bunker. Oh right, the plane where we were talking to that guy. He was telling us the cool story. Me. Now I know how to look for those. Hello, bummy rabbit. Is there anything else down here that I missed? Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. It's looking like no, so let's just jump up, ways. I do like when games include concept art like that, it's cool. Oh, hang on. You? There we go. Take damage to get figments. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I like this nice little bunny just surrounded by hearts. Ugh, there's no way to get any higher. You must use your levitation power. I don't know how to levitate. Uh oh. I had no idea you were at such a remedial level. Hey. Lucky for you, we have one of the world's foremost levitators on staff. Agent Mia Vodello, the mental minx. Precisely. You'll need this oarsman's badge to reach her at the docks. I'll try to determine where this interference is coming from. Return when you've earned your levitation merit badge. Time to learn how to levitate. Let's, uh, take the warp pipe, first of all. Down we go! Where would you like me to take? Where would you like me to take? Um, the, the... Is it the main lodge that has the shopping? Drop me outside the main lodge. Oh, bring me back a burger this time, will you? A burger? Desperate for a hamburster. A squirrel, it's not letting me levitate a squirrel. I wanted to levitate a squirrel. <laughs> it sounds like a sloppy jalopy that won't start. Hey guys. Did you hear something, Frankie? Nope. Guys. Hey. Hey. It's verded. I'm right next to you. Hey. Oh, what is it, Vernon? Have you guys seen Dogen or Elka or Milka? We were playing hide and seek, and it's actually a funny story. I said I'll count to a hundred, and then... Stop! We saw them. We saw all of them, just like five seconds ago. They were headed towards that place, the one that's so far away. The what? The beach? No, that's too close. The woods. The really far woods. Thanks. Oh, they're just getting this guy to go away. <laughs> Aren't they? <laughs> Where 
Where'd you get your clothes? Oh, right, it's just that again. That's mean. Uh... Let's go in the lodge. Time for shopping! Hey, anything new in the store? Take a look! Oh, that's my last cobweb duster. Take that into someone's mind with you. Can you buy that? You can clean yes, up. we can. No, we can't. It's too whips, expensive. And you can turn them in for side cards. That's too expensive. Hey, can you put that on my tab? Ah, sorry, Mac. No can do. We only trade in hard, cold, titanium arrowheads here. Sorry. If you don't have enough, why don't you run around outside a bit and dig some up? Or crack open some mental vaults. Always something valuable in a vault. Okay. And with that, uh, you can change the color of some of your... Ah, now here's something every... And with that, ah, now here's something... Now that Dawson Rod will help you find arrowheads that are buried this deep. Time. Alrighty then. Dowsing Rod can be used to find deeper, more valuable titanium arrowheads. Put the Dowsing Rod and watch and listen to its changing color and sound. This is how it lets you know that you are getting closer to a deep arrowhead. Uh, once in the right spot, press Y very rapidly to extract the arrowhead from the what ground. What else can I do you for? Now, uh, you take that side for there. Take it. Sold to the big-headed kid with the gloves. What else can I do you for? Now, take it. Let's buy another one. Sold uh, to the big-headed kid with the gloves. What else can I do you for? Let's buy another one. Sold to the big-headed kid with the gloves. What else can I do you for? That's it for now. Okay, bye. All right, go get more airheads and come on back. Support your local hmm. merchants. I'm not picking up anything. Must not be any deep arrowheads nearby. Okay, that's funny. Now put me down. Okay, 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 that's funny. Now put me down. Okay, that's funny. on the side doesn't really seem to be moving in any way that makes sense to my brain. Yep. Oh, the meter only moves when you slam Y. There we go. Okay, so like that. I'm not understanding something about this mechanic. I feel like I tried it around that area and it didn't work last time. My bad. Oh man, I 
feel terrible about that. Hey, put me down, or my dad will sue your whole family. Put me down, or Kitty's dad will sue your whole family. <laughs> right, I get that pitch is supposed to indicate that you're on top of it, but I keep thinking that it's supposed to get higher than it ever does. Like, I keep th thinking that every time I'm listening for a higher pitch, no matter what. Can't get a good grip. What? That went wide! <laughs> Partner, it weren't great, but it weren't bad neither. I'm playing with mouse and keyboard? No, I have a Switch Pro controller. Don't be late. Levitation class has already begun. Oh god, we're late, Come we're late, we're late. The floating dock before the party is over. Oh god, we're late, we're late! Let's check the map, I suppose. That might be helpful. <laughs> uh, just out there. Okay. The water. You have a water phobia? Me too! Huh? No. Well, yes. I just... You know, my family has this problem with water. It's a bunch of hooey anyway. Some old gypsy curse about how we're all supposed to die in water. If you can believe that. Oh! I thought it was about the whole thing with the brain-eating fish that walks out of the lake at night to hunt for victims. The what? Distractions. Excellent. Bye. <laughs> you know how it is when you got an ancient bloodline curse. What? No, I meant the horrible monster that just happens to live in the water. Well, see ya. I'm gonna go pace towards the water. The fact that he ran towards the water again, that was the funniest part to me. Tony, are you okay? I had the strangest machine-induced dream about you. TV? Well, first of all, Sasha 9 invited me the down to the secret lab music. and... TV? <laughs> He's completely brainless. The dream was true. Dogen, don't worry. I know where your brains are. They're in... Like this crazy... Dream Thornbush Straight Jacket Tower Place. Aggie Zack. You go to the TV lounge. I'm on the case. I just need a little more advanced training to prepare. It's a nice fish. Mental cobwebs getting you down. I've got just the device up here in the main large store. Why don't you come on up and score yourself a cobweb dusty before they're all sold out? Bro, you started talking in your dialogue box as soon as I tried to take a picture. Very rude. There are cards and stuff I could pick up here. Let's go pick them up. get two more card level things. I should probably do that soon. Ow! I was okay, that's funny. Now put me down! Ow! I 
you'll take one of these paddles to your psychic behind if you don't knock that off. Check it out, Admiral. I'm an oarsman, first class. Hey, it looks like all those weeks in the canoe simulator really paid off. The what uh, simulator? Yes, sir, Admiral, sir. Well, it, it, let's get you afloat. Finest of the fleet. The what now? I'll take good care of her, sir. That lake isn't as peaceful or as harmless as she looks. <laughs> now, don't take her out too far. It's definitely safe and allowed for us to do no, this. You don't. Daisy. What's that round thing up on the dock? That thing? Oh, man. Let me tell you about that thing. That thing is none of your stinking business. Oh, no. Oh, that was your fatal mistake. I hope you have a will. <laughs> Let me you down. been fish. Let me down. Let me down. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> oh no, you! A to paddle forward, press B to paddle back. Okay. I miss canoeing. I haven't been canoeing in a long time. So where do I go? Uh-huh. Holy mackerel! Oh, sorry, not you. Okay! I really don't like being up this high! <laughs> hey, Elton. Have you heard anything else about that thing in the lake? Huh? Oh, not really. The fish are kind of going crazy about Bobby and Benny over there torturing anything that swims too close. Oh, somebody should do something. Yeah. Well, <laughs> okay, I hi. suppose I could go talk to them. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> really? Well, see you next time. Whoops, I hit the wrong button. Let's get back in. Can I park over here? Is that allowed? That's making a good sound. Can I not dock here? Guess I can't dock here. What if I... I see. Remember to keep filling up those scavenger hunt forms. We got a couple of big promotions for the winner. Really? That's fine. That's fine. That's good. That's fine. That's fine. It's safe to do that. It's totally fine when I do that. There's no problems when I do that. Oh, I jumped over it. <laughs> yep. Here we go. Can't use that one. Oh, I... I could have made the jump from... From the beach, I could have just made it from the beach. I didn't. I didn't mean to try and jump through the through the canoe. Okay. <laughs> I see. You're kidding me. Ah, 
Three strikes and you're out. I do think it's funny for whenever games come up with an excuse for why you can't, like, be in a Tell water. Me everything. Uh, sometimes it's a nation family bloodline curse. Sometimes it's the fact that all the water on Earth is filled with leeches now. Sometimes you're a cat made of clay. Where's that canoe again? They can't find the ship, eh? Well, well, you're not off to a promising start, Seaman. It's right outside. You, you can't miss it. Well, most people couldn't miss it. I missed it. Also, let's go talk to these goons again. <laughs> What are the chances that if I ask nicely, you two will stop messing with those poor fish? About as good as the chance that if you say one more freaking word to me about fish, the fire department's gonna have the jaws of life, my fist, out of your mouth! So wait, does that mean you will? I will punch you. That's what that means. I am the hideous, hulking lungfish of Lake Oblongata. I can breathe air and love to eat the brains of little boys. I'm calling it now. There's going to be an actual hideous lungfish of Lake Oblongata at some point. Don't make me go get my fish friend again. <laughs> I ain't afraid of no lungfish. Come on and get me, stupid. Hey! Ew, look at me! Hey! Big deal! So can I! Where'd the other guy go? Nope! Nope! Get out of that one! Whoop! whoop nope! Has anyone seen... Oh, wait, hang on. Levitation class starting now. Please report to the floating dock immediately. Don't be late for the party, children. Love, Mia. Notice, I have retained the services of Mikhail Bulgakov as my personal bodyguard. Anyone wishing to do harm to my person is requested to speak to Mikhail first, so he can pummel you into the ground. Sincerely, Maloof. Oh, yeah, uh, Ben Rees just dead now. I got eaten by the fish. It's fine. Uh, Bubby's still there. Hey. If anyone sees Vernon waiting for me down by Makeout Cave, could you make out with him yourself? Because I'm not interested. Frankie. Dear Alien Voices, spaceship flight tests were fruitful, but I need more data on triple light speed travel. I am building a super antenna to receive data and placing it as high as possible. Please transmit data in T minus two hours, Chloe. Shooting lessons today at the old target range by the main lodge. Come on by and let old JT show you a thing or two. Has anyone seen Dogen Boo? There we go. He didn't show up for band practice, and I'm a little worried about him. Phoebe. Levitation class. Hey, seagull, what's up? <laughs> you can talk to the seagulls, that's cute. Okay, that's probably enough fooling about, unless we go talk to you again. You say something to us. Was rad. <laughs> Thanks. You're pretty rad too. Oh. They're friends. Oh, they're holding hands. Okay. If you guys need me, I'm gonna be studying levitation with Mia Vodello. Okay. If you guys need. Okay. If you... Okay. 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 Hey. If you guys need me, I'm gonna be studying. <laughs> Levitation with Mia Vodella. Okay, I really don't oh, like being the up mental this means. high. Okay, if you guys need me, I'm gonna be studying levitation with Mia Vodella. He's just hovering. The mental links. He's just hovering. Okay, I really don't like oh. being up this high. Oh, they were holding hands and they were being cute and I like ruined that because I wanted to do a trick on them. <laughs> Oops. Oh, there's a card up there. Oh, a card up there. I want it. No, no. no. Ow. 
Come on. I was so close. Oh, there's a card over there, too. It's gonna take me 300 years to get back to doing more of the story because I keep seeing goodies to collect. I keep seeing goodies! There's too many collectibles! What's up? They keep giving me treats to eat. They're like, okay, you can go on and like engage with our very cool story that we've written, or, you know, here's a plate full of goodies for you. What's that? Psychonauts comic number one. Oh yeah, that was one of the one of the the the, the scavenger hunt things. We can't, like, actually read that, can we? It's just, like, an item to collect for the scav hunt. Ooh, card. We should probably go turn in those markers. It's just a collecty. Okay. Uh, flavor text in the menu, though? I like flavor text. Uh... Psychonauts comic number one. The thrilling origin issue in which the Psychonauts get their name and design their first costumes also introduces the character of Clyde the Cautious Cougar, who teaches fire starting safety. <laughs> Good for him, I think. Already sad. I'm hoping Clyde the Cautious Cougar is just an actual cat with psychic abilities. That a dead pain. There's a hole at the bottom of this stump. Wow! It's a tunnel that opens onto a system of catacombs. Raz, you've seen like 30 of these. Raz, you've seen 30 of these! Through. You know what these are! Like me to take you, Agent uh, Let's go to Forge. Yes, no. Off we go. Rank 29. Damn, we're close. Hey, bud. Agent Crawler? Charm, huh? Uh, I better go. Good luck, Rasputin. Just wondering if he had anything new to say to us. Yep. Wee. Where would you like? Uh, like. It's time to go to the lake. Yes, sir, Admiral, sir. Hey, Seagull, what's up? It's nice to talk to seagulls. What do you get for climbing the ranks? You get upgrades, new powers. Presumably also upgrades to powers at some point, I imagine. It seems like a standard thing for a game like this. Yep. You can get your coconut gun fires and spurts, but you can also get, you know, the upgrades, the, the ammo homes in or whatever. Stuff like that. That's not the way about here. Visible wall, damn. Ah, I keep thinking I can get up on those walls. How to do this? Maybe this is another case of just come back later, but also I'm stubborn. But also, I'm stubborn. Oh? Oh? Come on, come on. On a rock, please. Ah. 
Chunky Kong's series of powers are very funny to me because it's like, oh, well, he's very strong, so he has strength powers. But, you know, also he's very afraid all the time, so what do we give him? The power to just get the hell out of there. The power to just never be perceived. That's Kong's ability, right? Maybe I just can't make that jump. I'm just gonna take the canoe. Although... Although... No, I can't get to that side. Can I go just around the cabin, though? Here I was telling myself I'd just progress. Nope, I can't go around. Okay, they thought of that. I mean, they kind of stopped paying attention to, like, all the Kongs except for, like... Donkey and Diddy for the longest time, they like started acknowledging like Cranky and Dixie too. Rasputin is a sick fucking donut in the middle of the lake. thought about messing around with uh, the tag barrel wherever mod uh that seems like it would cut down on a lot of the tedium of that game which sounds neat also thank you real bowser lover for the sub okay let's park our fucking boat what's this all about eh oh man these guys are all getting advanced levitation training while i'm just standing here there she is. And there you are, darling. Don't worry, I got in contact with your father, and he's going to be here tomorrow to pick you up. My father? Uh-oh. Oh, go to go. The race is starting. Lily. Oh, hey, Raz. Listen, I made you something. It's kind of stupid, but... They stole Dogen's brains. No, he's just like that. I had a nightmare where this mad scientist guy said he was going to take them out, and- Was it a creepy-looking freak with a shower cap and a stainless steel three-pronged claw? Hey, that's my nightmare. So it's not just me. But how? And why all the meat? I don't know, but I think it's time I find out where this is coming from. <laughs> Let's rendezvous tonight at the old boathouse for debriefing. This is so cool. Yeah, it feels like that time in True Psychic Tales 314 where... Shut up! <laughs> She's fun, I like her. I like... wait, hang on. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. This guy has two teeth, and he's using them all the time for his abilities. Hey, free airplane rides today. Ha <laughs> ha! Yay! Raz learned telekinesis! Right on! Anyways, I do like, uh, how, like, Lily's character has, like, pretty much immediately gone from, oh, I'm just the character that exists, uh, because the, the main character needs a love interest or whatever, to, like, immediately just going, like, Wait, you've been having the dream, too, haven't you? You know about the incident. Okay, it's time to solve a fucking mystery together. That's fun, I like that. <laughs> I, I like her so far. I'm excited for them to become friends. I was already floating, Rasputin. That's hardly a challenge. Agent Bodello? 
I have been ordered to report here for levitation training. I've already done the coach's obstacle course, and Sasha showed me how to shoot. You know, I'd expect that sort of recklessness from Orso, but Sasha? Agent Nine said you were the most powerful levitator the Psychonauts had. Sasha said that? Really? I didn't know he noticed. Well, huh. you know, I only work with the best teachers. Flirt! Okay, let's party. I like her. Look she seems fun. Scene. Agent Vodello? Where are you? On TV, of course. Where I was always meant to be. I mean, look at my hair, darling. How can hair this fabulous not be on TV? Now, darling, the best way to learn levitation is to just try it. I'm going to give you a levitation learner's permit. It will only work while you're in my mind. After you finish my course, I'll give you the real thing, baby. First, you gotta show me you know how to use it. Okay. That kid gonna fall? No, that kid's fine. Press L to levitate. Now bounce on up here and follow me, darling. There you go. Oh, fun! This is like faster movement too. Is it? Actually, I'm not sure. It feels faster. You don't. You can't double jump with it, but you jump higher anyway. So. Can you attack down with it? Yes, you can! And I like the little balls following us, too. That's cute. Okay, this is fun. This is fun. I'm really liking the, like... The vibe of this place. The appearance. It's like... What's what's that one Sega game with, like, the... the the, the dancing and the reporter, it's like Space Channel Awesome or whatever, Space Channel 5. Channel Awesome is the Nostalgia Critic thing, isn't it? <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> what have I done? <laughs> what have I done?
I got it wrong. It was the wrong part of the song. Hi, hey, what's up? I got ice cream. Uh. <laughs> I sang the wrong part of the song very beautifully. Well, that's kind of you to say. <laughs> Just like learn to sing uh, some of the songs from Sinar Wild Hearts at some point. I know like bits and pieces of some of them, and I like the music in that game, so might be a pretty excuse to get some more singing practice. Thank you, Full Cap, for the 13 months. Mario. I'll like catch myself sometimes when I'm like home alone or in the shower sometimes I'd also be like humming to myself like something's changed and I didn't know you're petting the cat and that's not the lyrics but I'd say that when I'm petting my cat I don't know enough of the lyrics of Sonic Underground to sing it but <laughs> I'm also very excited for the Outer Wilds DLC. I'm just gonna have a bit of this ice cream. Before we get back to it. How's everyone doing tonight? Y'all enjoying the stream? I'm having a good time so far. What server do you post Holly fan art to? Mine. You join my server and you post it there. Hey, maybe we'll actually be able to do, like, two levels today. I guess three? The, the Tumblr is kind of a level in and of itself, even if it is probably, like, we're gonna have to keep coming back to this later. Singing to cats is awesome, and I think everyone who has a cat should do it, or anyone who sees a cat should do it. Finished a comic while watching? Hell yeah! Happy to hear it. It always makes me happy when people are like, Oh yeah, I've been listening to your stream in the background and like, I got something cool done. That makes, that makes me, that makes me smile real big. That makes me can't stop smiling. That's not English correctly. <laughs> Your cats yell at you if you sing too loud? My cat yells at me at the drop of a hat, whatever, whenever she wants. Um, this morning she was yelling because people left the house and also her food bowl was moved very slightly to the side and she was heartbroken. Surprised Lola hasn't yelled during the stream? That's because tonight she's feeling fine. She's She's all snuggled up with like my dad, I think. Which is her favorite thing to do in the evenings. She'll probably come by later and scream for food. 
That's part of her ritual. <laughs> She's a very strict schedule she has to follow. It was very hot today. It was a curse of miserable swamp heat. Uh, so I had to put the air conditioner back on. And I forgot to go for a walk. Maybe that's fine, given how it was awful outside. Uh, I did a workout anyways, so... I suppose it ain't the worst. How do you lose a mango? You put it down somewhere and forget where you put it. Or you put it near um, an animal that likes to eat mango, and then you don't pay attention to the animal that likes to eat mango. <laughs> That's how they get you. I am almost done my ice cream, then we'll get back to it. Play for another couple of hours, depending on how long I want to go for. I don't want to go too late tonight, just because I've been trying to, like, re-wrangle my sleep schedule to, like, stop me from going to bed so late and waking up so late, uh, like I have been lately, but... Also, I want to play this game, so... <laughs> we'll see. Only recently been catching my streams, but they have a very nice and pleasant energy you appreciate. That's kind of you to say. Thank you. I'm glad to hear that. That makes me happy. I know I'm like... Well, sometimes I get excited, but I'm like not always uh, super loud and bombastic uh, just because I'm not like that as a person. Uh, or as a performer, unless I feel like I have to. But, uh... I don't know, it makes me happy when people say they enjoy the way the streams are all the same. I'm just doing what I want to do, what I would want to see in a broadcast, and glad other people enjoy it too. I just want to thank you for streaming. I got surgery and tons of my five days ago, and your streams have helped as I am recovering. Hey, hell yeah! Congrats! I hope this I hope the recovery goes well. Thank you for the 10-month resub, I really appreciate that. I am... done... my ice cream, so... I'm gonna scoop out a little bit of melted bits from the bowl. <laughs> I'll put my little bowl down, I'll have a big drink. What kind? Oh, it was just vanilla ice cream, but I put like a, a little drizzle of a caramel on top of it. It's good. I'm gonna stop the music now. I stopped the music now. Uh, let's go back to the game. Uh, and. Get to play him. Thank you, KC, for the tip. Hi, Holly. Did you know psychokinesis abilities are real? Watch this. Okay. I'm watching. I'm watching. Okay, I'm watching. I'm watching. When is it happening? Awesome! 
<laughs> Anyways, as I was saying before, I made a Doug Walker the Nostalgia Critic accident. Uh, this this place reminds me of like this like mix between like uh, like a Space Channel Five and uh, like a disco parlor, which is fun. The Doug Walker Incident of 2021. I just broke her TV. Ball. Oh, we can just like slap an attack while we're riding this. Okay. I have no reason to never get off the ball unless I need like a precision jump. Now for this last one, you're really gonna have to fly. Once you get up in the air, try using your thoughts as a balloon to float. Just jump for those rings as high as you can and then do your side float. Don't be afraid, darling. I literally love being afraid all my life, I'm afraid. <gasps> it's my good friend teleport options! Bubble bounce, then press L while airborne to float over the gap. So like, like this. Okay, there we go. And that's how we get our precision falling. I'm having fun attacking anything, though, so... Music in here is fun. One. I missed. Again. Probably should have done that a bit later. My good friend Teleport Options is here, though, so... There we go. Clean! Clean! Okay, now, just between you and me, this end of the party is dead. Come find me on the other side of the party, and I'll give you that merit badge for real. Never keep a girl waiting long, young man. Goodies? Goodies for me? Thank you. She's fun. I like her. Uh, go to the top floor of this crazy club. What if there's goodies here? goodies here. Thought there might be that. Uh, although... Can I get up on top of you? Uh, can't get up on the side there like I thought I could. button. I press the turn off ball button instead of the, the hover button. Oh yeah, I fully expected uh, all the gay people in chat to just go wild to this level, I'll be honest. Stay on the ball in here, Rasputin, if you want to get higher. And see if you can get all those rings spinning, Mr. DJ. Hey, Mr. DJ. Oh hey, nice. I was I was gonna make a joke and be like, oh yeah, I get it, she's my type, but like my type is women, so <laughs> So like yeah, of course. There we go. I got the goodie. It's 
hard to see some of them in here. You are the sugar in my bowl, darling. Now just follow the flowers, won't you? And try to stay rolling at all times. That is the theme of this party. Okay. Enjoy an awesome ball in this zone. Okay, back to start. I do like- oh, oh! I thought I heard something. Yeah, this game's great so far. Thank you very much for that reset. I appreciate it. Hope you're doing well. I had to get that goodie. I saw it. I seen it. I seen it. But it will let you down nice and slow. <laughs> also, I like that this level is now, like, pinball themed as well. Hey, will you teach me how to dance? Come on, dance, baby! <laughs> is this just like a psychic projection of a haunted woman in her mind or something? Or is this supposed to be a person? Hey, will you teach me how to dance? Come on, dance, baby! This is the Nights into Dreams pinball level. Hey, will you teach me how to dance? Watch and learn, kid. Milia, Mia just filled her mind with big titty woman to dance with, and I think it's very poggers of her. Hey, you wanna dance? Good for her. Yay! I already am! Come join us! Honestly, good for her. That sounds like the ideal. Hey, you wanna dance? Um, no thanks, Raz. Hey, will you teach me how to dance? Come on, dance, baby! Hey, will you teach me how to dance? Come on, dance, baby! <laughs> Crying in the club. Crying no longer in the club. I'm seeing multiple people say, oh, me in high school. You went clubbing in high school? Huh? Oh, look, he's bobbing to the beat. That's called Chuck E. Cheese! I like that Raz still has the stern expression on his face. He's allowed to have a little bit of fun. He's allowing himself to have a little bit of fun. <laughs> Can't get a good grip. Can't get a good grip. Can't get a good grip. 
<laughs> Yay! Raz learned telekinesis! Right on! Let's go grab these. He's birthday party man. Okay, so we want to get just there, right? One, two, three. Thank you, sweetie. I feel so much better now. Ah, the bumper. I always had a soft spot for pinball levels. And this is extremely a pinball level. <laughs> Ooh, look at the crowd. Things are starting to pick up. See that draft up above, darling? Jump into it and float and see where it takes you. But there's other things around here I want to see first. I cannot run atop of this. Okay, noted. Kinda wanted to though. Kinda wanted to though. This room's no fun. Let's leave, baby. Huh. Mia's children. Killer right there. Darling, hey, the fun's down here. The party is upstairs. Lucky for you, I have my nightmare under control. This thing can take you to a world of pain, trust me. Now, quick, let's get back to the party, okay? Darling, if you're looking for the makeup room, you've come to the wrong place. Save us. You just take a little nibble of that and see if I can taste it too. Bro, get me the fuck out! <laughs> You're ready to take on a new psychic power. Ready to come back and get your new merit badge? Yes, let's go! Yes. Alrighty then. <laughs> Grandpa, I wanna go home! Recognition of your hard work, dedication, and mental agility. I'm proud to bestow upon you the official merit badge for. Invisibility! Okay, let's play a game. Look out, another sensor. Oh no, you're out of- Hello, Rasputin. I want to play a game. <laughs> you don't appreciate life, so I'm going to make you go invisible around some bear traps. You got about an hour. Famo. No, I'm not. You are now. Here are the rules. Take this guy out. But if he sees you at all, you lose. Go get him. Hey, where'd he go? Oh, well done. Now that's the power of invisibility. Nice. I think I've heard the kids around camp refer to this technique as uh, silent but deadly. Uh... Hmm. 
I like how, like, a lot of the other ones have had, like, little bits about, like, Raz's, like, you know, backstory and family life and situation and all that stuff. And then, uh, this one is just, Well, that's enough of that now. Why don't we just have a good old-fashioned fart joke? <laughs> Thanks, bud. Agent Crawler? Charm, how goes the training? I'm ready to go back into the field. Okay, let's see if I remember exactly where you were. All right, back to the nightmare. Oh, all the way back here, huh? I mean, that's, that's reasonable enough as far as, like, okay, well, it doesn't know your, like, exact position, but, uh, it would have been very deeply funny to just be like, all right, time to put you back where you were and, like, put us in the nightmare dimension. Let's see, where was we again? Like, it was over there, right. Down we go. Okay, what's the situation? Wanted to see if he had anything to say on this. Uh need your analysis on a hostel. What kind? Uh I guess I've never seen any of these ones, so we might as well listen to this. So we talked about the bear, we talked about uh, the teeth. How do you fight sensors? Anything works on those guys. You can punch them, shy blast them. It's fun to set fire to them or confuse them too. <laughs> Pick them up with TK and throw them. Make yourself invisible and sneak up on them. Lots of fun, those guys. You can just kind of do whatever to them. They're, they're real pushovers. You ever play a Super Mario kid? You know about them Goombas? It's kind of like that. What about those sensors that shoot stuff? Oh, you gotta grab those guys with your mental focus lock. Then you can jump left or right to avoid their shots while side blasting them from a distance. Oh yeah, the side hop. That's something I should probably use more. Uh... What if there's like a million tiny sensors all over you? Ah, the palm bomb. Just jump up in the air and then punch. And that is what I've been doing. So hard, those little guys just pop like popcorn. Huh. I was right. I figured out the smart person strategy because I'm 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 the smart person. It's me. I'm the genius level of gamers. You've been very helpful. That's all I need. Good luck. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Agent Cruller, do you have any advice on the current situation? Do whatever Mia says, young man. You're in her classroom now. Nothing more to report at this time. Crawler out. All right, kid. See you later. That's why I swear that eyes burning. Ah, fuck! You did this to us. I do like that. Uh, you know, when you go to the nightmare room, it's not like. Uh, oh no, this here's this horrible part of me. I don't want anyone to know about it. I'm so broken. I'm awful. She's just kind of like, man, you probably don't want to be here. This shit sucks. Uh, you know how it is, but this ain't for you though. Come on. Go back to the party. Go have fun. Bro, you're 10. I'm an adult. I got this under control. You're just a kid who's here to bounce on the balls. goodies around here. Give me the boost. Tunk tag. 
Yeah, it is It is kind of a very literal metaphor for compartmentalizing, isn't it? <laughs> Ants! Ah, another tag. There's a side plot planned where Mia's nightmares would escape to other minds, but they decided Mia wouldn't endanger the campus like that. I'm honestly glad that they didn't go with that in the end. I, 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 I kind of don't like the idea of, oh no, here's this poor, helpless woman who puts on the airs of being like... Uh, strong and in control of her emotions, but really it's all spiraling out of control. She can't handle it. Like, no. She can. It's not like it's an easy thing to just get over, like, get over fucking your entire orphanage burning down and, like, the screaming, like, dying minds of 20 or 30 children haunting you, but, like... It's not gonna be like, oh yeah, by the way, she's totally awful and busted and there's, like, it's hopeless for her or whatever. No. It doesn't, and I'm glad it doesn't. I want to see if I can jump up here. I'm just kind of rolling around. Uh, there we go. Ah, it's my good friend the trunk. Look at look at these dancing figments hanging out with the crying trunk. Wow, you. Clang in the crub, the sequel. I said crub instead of club. I'm a fool. I'm a goon for this one. There we go. Can I bust this? Can I get through this? Can I get to the fish tank? Oh, this just goes all the way back round, okay. Well, here's the goodies I missed. It's really hard to see the figments in here, I'm finding. Like, some of them, like, blend in just with the background. Boing. 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 It's a good thing I haven't committed to doing some kind of 100% playthrough, right? Right? Tugging my collar and looking nervously at the camera, right? Oh, I was supposed to do something there. Oops. Whoops. I mean, I didn't, but you know how I get with games like this. I guess more specifically, I know how I get with games like this. Ah, bouncing. You miss a jump, turn. Okay, uh, balls time. I like this disco ball. percent playthroughs are really hard. Yeah, that's why I'm glad that I can just, like, you know, return to levels whenever I want, more or less. Aside from, like, the basic raining one, but I'm assuming there's a way to get there, because the door is still there, eventually, so. Oh, wait, wait, hang on, hang on, you! My friend.
I mean, like, I can already revisit Sasha's level, so... I imagine they're just, like, story progress I have to make before I can access Oleanders again. I know there's some story stuff involving Oleander. Don't say anything uh, for the sake of folks that don't know about that. And also, I don't know, like, complete details for some of it, so, like... You know, there's there's probably a perfectly reasonable explanation, etc., etc. Uh, I gotta grind the rails like like Sonic the Hog. Also, yeah, please don't do the koi shit either, unless it's like, unless it's like something I've already done as a joke, in which case, sure, whatever. But like, if I just kind of mention something offhand, please don't be like, oh, hmm, I wonder what this could mean. Hmm, no one to tell her, huh? Because that's that's real fucking annoying. <laughs> I hate that shit. Like, I hate it when it's unwarranted. If it's like something I'm like doing and in on, then it's like, sure, whatever. People are just going along with the joke. But like... If you want to be like, hmm, sure don't know what that means, huh? That's weird. Hmm, wonder what that is, huh? Like, just, just do that with your friends. Just, just do that with your friends instead of subjecting me to it. I don't think that's come up today, but you know, it bears repeating. There we go. Uppy daisy! Oh, no, I missed it. I missed it. I missed it. Where is it? Where is it? There we go. Hey, partner. Hey, wanna dance? Um, why don't you go ask Elka? She loves to dance. Ugh, go stampede someone else. Hey, wanna dance? You better back off, or my boyfriend James will go nuts. He's so jealous and protective of me. Yo! Why are boys such pests? Hey, will you teach me how to dance? Come on, dance, baby! Whoa! I know you didn't just do that. I did. Hey, wanna dance? Yes, teach me of your earth rhythms. I like the alien kid, she's fun. Oh, that's not how we dance on my planet, Earthling. <laughs> that's fun. I feel like this game is very good at capturing, you know, like how goofy kids can be sometimes. Hey, will you teach me how to dance? Come on, dance, baby! Hey, will you teach me how to dance? Watch and learn, kid. Yep. Fun fact, Mia called Oleander Morceau. His full name is Morceau Oleander, since Morceau can mean a short literary or musical composition. This may be a jab at his height. Morceau is just French for, like, a little bite of something. Like, just like a tiny nibble, a snack. Uh, it's morsel. They're really out here just naming this guy Coach Maybe Just a Bite, Oleander. <laughs> Perhaps just one little nibble couldn't hurt Oleander. <laughs> Maybe I deserve just a little treat, Oleander. Well, one little bite couldn't hurt, Oleander. Etc. Etc. <laughs> we got any other uh, goodies in this room that I can find? Nothing made to be obvious that I can see. Huh. These guys got hats on. Are they ready to party? Oleander is an extremely toxic plant. Huh. Neat. Oh, you can do flips and stuff when you're not targeted on something. Okay. Hey, hey! Mean to me! Come on! Hey, 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 hey! What you got? Open up. Mia's Adventures! Kids in this game had real in-character friendster pages during the game's original ad campaign. Oh, cute! Isn't that isn't that where like they they officially had the thing about the two the two lesbians being like actually in a relationship with each other? 
Also, here's the, like, good, exciting stuff they want you to see uh, about Mia's life. Solving psychic crimes. Stopping psychic villains. Going to psychic parties and stealing psychic keys. I like the the hole in the loop of her, her hair where you can see someone peeking through. God, she's so cool. All of these outfits are dope. Good for her, honestly. I think this one's my favorite. <laughs> Fucking Sasha in the background just still wearing like a full suit with his scuba gear. <laughs> is, is he just dressed like this everywhere he goes? Is he just like this all the time? Come on, bud. <laughs> I know you're like this, but spice it up a little. Oh, cute. Good for them. Good for them. You'll love to see it. Can we get some hearts in the chat for love? Now we're on the, the 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 Super Mario World Fortress climbing part of the game. Every platformer needs one, I suppose. Really hope there aren't any figments on this this chain link fence. Ah, fire, huh? Oh wait, never mind. There's other elements there too. I forgot to use my my gliding bit. I forgot to use my gliding bit to glide. Wow, sure is good that I definitely saw that figment that I just got and meant to get it on purpose. It sure would be fucked up if Mia's mind was full of Koopas right about now. When you are levitating, you are also protected from all sorts of icky things. But some things, like those spikes, those are always bad news, whether you are levitating or not. So watch out! If you're dealing with radiation, if you're dealing with uh, highly hazardous toxic chemicals, you should simply stand on a ball over them, and you'll be safe. Hmm, that shouldn't be happening. Oh. <laughs> Do you have some problems with water? Do you want to talk about it? Uh, it's a long story. Maybe later. Okay, I'm always here for you, darling. Let me just say that it's very normal for boys your age. That's that's some fun object culling there. <laughs> Ooh, hello? Uh, oh, it's not culling anymore. Don't worry, Rasputin. It's very normal and kind of awesome for boys your age to have a curse. around here. I, I, I do like that the one that doesn't, that you don't get protected from is the water. That's that's a fun bit of continuity about that. Hey, rank up. Close. Oh, each of these figments counts for more than just one. Okay. I thought each one you collected was like one point for your level up meter. It's not. bumper. Is that laughing or crying? I can't really tell. That's, that's crying. Okay. Whoop, whoop, whoo, whoo! That's no good! <laughs> Don't like that one!
Raz knows it's Wiggler Wednesday. Raz is here to wiggle. Raz knows all about wobbling, and that's why he's not tournament legal. Oh, I missed. No, I missed! Ugh! I wanted... I wanted the goodie. When I said hi, your kitty responded. Oh! Cute. What does this do? Uh, not much. Okay. Oh, that's just how you get to that bouncy bit over there. Right. Let me in, okay? Let me in, okay? Let me in, okay? We're at the top floor of this crazy club. It's time to beat stupid Bobby Zilch. Okay, it's time to see how fast you are, darling. Ready? Get set? Go, baby, go! Okay. Let's touch boost pads. This is fun. I wasn't expecting a race segment. Whee! I am pulling ahead, though. You'll love to see it. Don't hit that. Okay, that's good. Uh, watch out for bumpers. There we go, there we go. This is fun. I was getting a little close, but I'm sure we're fine. As long as we just keep hitting the boosters. Look out for the bumpers! Uh oh! Uh oh! It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Oh, it might not be fine. Woo! Oh, come on! I was so close. Damn. That's a bit of a bummer. Oh well. Not bad for my first try, I suppose. camera just showing okay. what the other racers are up to. Ready? Get set? Go, baby, go! Okay, take two. This time, simply don't lose. It's that easy. Pad. This. I missed that figment, but that's fine. I suppose we can just do the race some other time to get them. We're not allowed to go home until Raz wins the race. Bumpers, watch out for the bumpers. That's good. You love to see that. Uh, after you start a pom bomb, press X as many times as you can before you hit the ground. The more times you press, it, the higher the bonus damage. Okay, cool. I was right in the middle of the race. That scared me a little. <laughs> Look out for the giant foot. And hey, second try. Right? 
Second try, right? There we go. You win! You did it! You are quick like greasy lightning! I'm so proud of you, darling! You're so fast, you'll be at my party in no time, eh? By the way, you were invited to my birthday party! You have to go right now! Okay, if you want to get up to where the action is, you're going to have to do a lot of floating in this room, baby! Good thing you're so light on your feet! Well, you're born to float. Okay. Uh, it's my good friend teleport options! Hi, buddy! Where does this take me? Does this go anywhere? No. But it's cool that we beat stupid Bobby Zilch. Rasputin, you are always invited to my birthday party at Chuck E. Cheese. We have those in this time period, right? What time period is this game set in? Is was it was it in a time where Chuck E. Cheese existed? That's that's the most important question of all. I can't believe I'm genuinely fucking asking this. <laughs> they never say? Fun. Ambiguously 80s, okay. I wasn't sure if it was meant to be like, yeah, this is like a around the 80s type of game, or if it was just like, uh, the fact that psychics are real just means that, uh, uh, visual aesthetics in the United States never got past our, our modern day 80s. Or our, uh, real world 80s, rather, not modern day 80s, I suppose. That's a bit of a strange misnomer there. It's set in the early 2000s, huh? Well, I'm getting a lot of different answers from different people, so I'm not trusting any of them. <laughs> Ain't that just the way with the Twitch chat? Hey, Ryan with the raid! The Bi Spiral. I've heard they call that one the Biral. Biral the Dragon. Coming soon to your... What system do they put the Spiral games out on? I reckon it's all of them nowadays, isn't it? This joke is going nowhere. Thank you for the raid! <laughs> Hope you had yourself a wonderful stream today. Playing some Psychonauts. It's my first time playing through this game, so I'm having a delight so far. I'm just kind of messing around, having a good time. Hitting the wrong buttons, but that's okay. As long as I don't die. I've only died once, so. If you float in some areas, you might get a little more oomph than usual. Yes, ma'am. Thank you for the oomph, ma'am. do tend to die when they're killed, yeah. It's it's kind of messed up how that works, isn't it? You got any other goodies around here? You can go here. What do you do? Now you're going to have to use your Cyphlot again to get those ring speed. Ah. I see. Uh. However... Get over there. Hit this again doesn't do anything. Hmm. Headed out for the night. Well, thank you so much for stopping by. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your evening. Uh, I mean, I guess. Oh, that's. Well, what is that over there? I want to get that goodie. I guess the answer for that one is just get to the end to get it, but. Here we go, here we go, here we go. I, and I'm totally doing the wrong thing for that. Okay. Oh, we tried it. Never mind, I'm actually a genius. That's the solution. Uh, aggressive capacity increased. Nice. That's a cute little icon for that. Now you have the capacity to be even more angry whenever you want. Uh, this is good and healthy, I bet. I mean, you know, feeling anger, just like feeling any, uh, 
emotion in the human emotional range is, is healthy. It means you're alive. It means you're working. Uh, if you float in some areas, you might get a little more but than Something usual. is deeply funny about just going like, Hey, here's a pickup for you. Now you can feel more angry. Yippee! Games are funny. Oh, I see. This is a big propeller. I understand now. Essence of Donald Duck is a very funny way of describing it. There we go, we got the primal memories. I do still stand by my theory that Donald Duck is a rage elemental. Oh, I guess you were supposed to try and go up through them, weren't you? No, this works. memories mean very different things in very different video games. Uh, in this one it means concept art. In Final Fantasy for teen it means tempering. And that one's bad. But this one is good, so who's to say? If you're sending Donald Duck to prison, I'm staging a jailbreak right now. I love that little man. I love that duck. Uh, this is where the magic happens. the wrong button again. I keep hitting the stop ball button instead of the hover button. Whoops, whoops, down we go. I did it again. <laughs> One of these days I'm gonna start stop fucking it up. Uh... But today is not that day. <laughs> Can we get behind here? No. Okay. Hey, will you teach me how to dance? Come on, dance, baby! Hey, will you teach me how to dance? Come on, dance, baby! I do like that her dreams, her, her mind world is just full of, like, beautiful women and hunky dudes on the dance floor. We love a bi legend. Oh, down I go. You try again. What? It just like gets rid of my ball there when I try and use it. Unless I'm just, like, pressing something without realizing it, which is also possible, but... I'm gonna try this again and see if it happens again! Okay, not this time. I guess maybe I was clipping too close to the, the ledge or something? That's possible, I suppose. There we go. Up ways we go. Who's being up here do for us, though? Whee! Well, it's fun to be up here, so... 
I suppose that's worth something. It is fun to be in the sky is the thing. That's why birds do it all the time. I'm learning so much from them every day. I'm always learning from birds. And I'm feeling so famous about it. I don't know why I chose to use the word famous there. It felt like the funniest adjective to use. Who's that I see? It's Rasputin, the rolling rock star in the flesh. And just in time, the party was dying without you, darling. Here, I have a little party favor for you. The Ball Anywhere protocol is now in effect. So cute. Rolling Rockstar. That's the name of the achievement we just got. Well, out we go. Don't be a stranger, darling. Thank you, Agent Vodello. Now it's back to the lab to save Dogen. Dogen's not in the lab, sweetie. He's watching TV in the lodge with the other children. I meant the dream Dogen from my brain tumbler vision. If I can find out what's happening to him, maybe that would give me a clue about who stole real Dogen's brain. Oh, I'm afraid he's just like that. <laughs> that does seem extremely just like a thing a kid would say, to be fair. <laughs> Excuse me, Agent Bodello. Hello, darling. Are you back for another dance? Uh... No, I'm here to warn you. I think there's a monster in the lake. You mean the hideous hulking longfish of Lake Oblongada? Yeah, darling, that one. Every summer camp has its stories, but that's all they are. This one ate Dogen's brains. Now stop spreading rumors. I know Dogen seems a little naive, but he's actually a very powerful psychic. You know what it's like to stand out, Rasputin. So maybe you could help him out, eh? You need to be nice to him, even if he's a little odd. No, I know that. I just mean, like, literally. His, his brain's been stolen. <laughs> I'm just here to say hi. Well, I just wanted to stop by and say hi. Oh, how nice. Isn't it a lovely day? It just seems like on a beautiful day like this, nothing could go wrong, you know? Something's about to go very wrong, isn't it? <laughs> Enough with the rough stuff, darling. She just does a flip. That's fun. Nothing bad ever happens to the Psychonauts, kid. Ford Crawler moments before getting run over by a train. Little Bobby bullshit's still there, so we can't go that way yet. Can we go under the bridge? Can we go under the bridge? Can we go under the bridge? We cannot. Looks like we should be able to. Alright, here we are, beached once again. Whoop, nope! <laughs> I forgot about that mechanic, I forgot! About that mechanic. <laughs> Alright, so we've got... Uh, no current Psy cards. Uh, go back to the Tumblr. We still can't afford the Cobweb Duster. up anything. Must not be any deep arrowheads nearby. All right, off we go. Where would you like me to take you, Agent Crawler? Uh... Agent Nine's lab. Oh, there's just an option for his lab. Okay. Pleasure. Rasputin, please. Germs. Okay. 
I'm a certified limitator now. Ready to roll. Hmm. I've been running some tests. It seems that the sensitive circuitry of the brain tumbler is picking up too much psychic interference to be safe. The thoughts of some other entity are interlacing with yours at a dangerous level, uh -oh. which explains many of the strange things you've seen. I must call off the experiments until we know more. Sasha, there's no time. I think my vision about Dogen came true. I'm worried it's gonna happen to the others if we don't get to the bottom of this quick. But we don't know where the foreign projections are coming from yet. Is there a faster way to find out than sending me in there to investigate? I do appreciate that Sasha's MO, at least so far, seems to be very much like, Hmm, well this sounds very irresponsible. We're going to do it anyway because it sounds cool as hell. Uh, this is the Brain Tumbler. We've got all the tags and all of the safes from Mila, for Mia. I keep pronouncing her name wrong. I'm probably going to keep doing that by accident for a while. Hi, Holly. Hi! Did you know in one of the Lord of the Rings RTs games you can control Tom Bombadillo as a unit and he wrecks stuff while being jolly and singing? Oh my god, thank god there's a Tom Bombadil unit that you can play as! <laughs> That's the good shit you do like to hear! <laughs> Tom Bombadil is one of my favorite characters in uh, Lord of the Rings. I just genuinely want, like, uh... A Tom Bombadil movie or video game. And it's it's or like a story even, and it's literally just about like uh there's like obliquely hinted at like information about like the goings on in the world around Tom Bombadil, but like none of it ever directly comes up because he's too busy just like having fun and like being with the animals and uh stuff like that. We were talking about this with uh Mike, uh, Spigoner, a while ago, and we came up with, like, a very, like, not thorough, but, like, idea of, like, what it would consist of, ideally, because Mike is the other Tom Bombadil enjoyer. It's funny, Bunny! Hi! 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 Is Tom Bombadil also in every video game? No, no, no. Tom Bombadil is in Lord of the Rings. Very different. Very different. Why are you screaming? All right, I remember. There. Oh, good boy. There's that pesky brain. Here's a tissue. Now, don't you feel better, my dear lad? TV? Of course! Right here! And this bad boy. We'll just drop it in the old garbage chute. Now, don't chew solid foods for six hours! Uh oh. The fact that his weird, like, evil scientist claw arm is just a pepper grinder is really good. Well, we're here in the Nightmare Tower. TV! 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 They're playing my favorite episode. Open up! Say, this looks suspicious. Say, this looks like the concept art. Hmm. I wonder what that could mean. Hmm. 
I really hope this thing is called the Think Tank. It's just the Brain Tank, okay. Oh, was I supposed to like hit it when it reared up its tummy like that? There we go. Soft gelatinous underbelly. Here I come. Oh, this. I see. I'm still supposed to hit the green bit. Okay. Don't touch that stuff. Versus the oh. Okay, it's confused. There we go. Okay, so you just have to sneak up to it when it's confused. I see. I'm understanding the mechanic. I'm understanding the mechanic of the video game. to be feeling the effects here. Okay. Let's get out. Okay, so this thing seems to recharge a lot faster if you don't use the entirety of it. Noted. up like that. That's cute. That was- oh my god, that was deafening. <laughs> Why? Oh, okay, we're not done the fight. I thought we were done. Kind of damage tanking this instead of trying to engage with the mechanic. <laughs> I mean, I can do it, so. Is this a nightmare? Or a plan? Or both? Wait a minute. Yeah, this room looks familiar, doesn't it? Hmm. Rasputin, I'm sorry. I had to abort the experiment. Something unbelievably urgent has come up and I must leave immediately. I know! You'll never believe- Hold that thought. In a rush. Official psychonaut business. Wait! So is this! Official psychonaut, hey? You forgot your- Hmm. Hmm. 
And I was just about to say... Hey, that oh. white room. I know. It's from Oleander's mind. Uh-huh. I think I was in the coach's dream that whole time. Ever since I stepped through the static in the caravan, it felt funny. I knew I wasn't obsessed with meat. But Mari is. And was stealing psychic brains to arm a fleet of deadly tanks, apparently. I've got to tell Lily. She's waiting for me down by the boathouse. Down by the... water? Uh-oh. Better hurry. I do appreciate that, you know, Agent Crawler rooting around in our brain, uh... Isn't like all the other people that would probably be like, well, you're just some kid. We got more important things to do, even if you do have powers or whatever. He is just like, oh, shit. Yeah, that's bad news, ain't it? <laughs> I really like Crawler. Crawler's good. And that's how you do the super slam. I forgot I had that. I could have been using that against the boss. I wonder if there's a max to that. Like if you can only get five or something. What if I try and get really high up and then try that? I mean, yeah, the fact that he is in our head certainly helps him, doesn't it? It is max five, okay. Also, yeah, before, like, that whole cutscene just, like, you know, telling you outright about it, I was about to say, hmm, yeah, this, like, giant blue blueprints world sure does seem familiar. Remember when we were in the coach's mind and we got to his, like, weird little side room and it just had, like, a blue thing in a frame? I wonder if that's related, hmm. Yes, it is. Yes, it very explicitly is. That bear still around here? Can I still beat up on that bear? Yes. Well, good night. There goes a psychic bear. What happens if you lose all your projection depth in the overworld? Do you get ejected from the dream of the video game? Let's... Uh, telekinesis. Blasting. That's how you do it. Put that there. Have that there. Do I have levitation on now? Nope. Still won't budge. Nope. Still won't budge. Huh. Nope. Still won't budge. Shows you a feed of your webcam? Well, joke's on them. I don't have one. So they get nothing. Oh, right. You. I want to throw you or something. Damn, no, okay. Children, please remember not to pet or feed the animals at Whispering Rock. The titanium in the food chain has caused numerous psychic mutations, and the animals you encounter, especially at night, might be more dangerous than the kind you have back. Invisibility. It's fucking At invisibility. Home. I can just go invisible. I don't need to sneak up on this guy to, like, blast him. I can just sneak up on him with invisibility powers. Mine. Golden acorn. Adult squirrels will often coat a regular acorn with a mucilaginous coat or mucilaginous secretion that gives it a shiny golden coat. This sparkly trinket is used to attract possible mates. Do not eat. 
It's covered in that muckus, yep. that yucky mucky. Don't touch that stuff, okay? I really wish this wasn't a mashing mechanic. I wish I could just hold it down. You learned to use Steam Controller Config this for this so you can use the turbo? I didn't even know you could do that with Steam Config for controllers. That's wild. Hey, bud. Mr. Crowley, you gotta help. Kids are getting kidnapped and everyone's missing and their brains are stolen. And I think the coach is trying to take over the world with psychically armed death tanks. Well, now, you see what happens when you go to parts of the forest that are off limits? Won't you help? I'm a ranger. I got enough problems wrangling these leaves. Now get That is a very strange conversation considering how he literally did just tell us, oh yeah, shit, that's real bad, ain't it? Yeah, I guess he is trying to be super undercover or whatever, so it's probably that, but it is funny. What does happen if we bake it in front of him? Let's try. That's a sentence I just said. Hey, how can you be over there and in my ear at the same time? Shh, you're blowing my cover. That part of my mind is running an undercover operation. While another part of my mind is projecting itself into your head here. Oh. Wow! You can do all that stuff at once? Well, you could say my brain is uh, multifaceted. Now then. Interesting. Interesting. Agent Cruller, do you have any advice on the current situation? Why are you just standing here when you should be running down to the lake to make sure your girlfriend isn't being kidnapped by the monster that lives in the water? Hey, we are just good friends. Oh, well, that changes everything. Just let her get eaten dead. <laughs> Why is that the thing you're focusing on? Nothing more to report at this time. Crawl her out. Ha. Okay, so... There we go. Give me the goods, give me the goods. Hey, rank up! Can we bust out of here? No, we gotta take a long way home, don't we? There we go. Swinging. Time for swinging. Ah, time to ride the log. All of these goodies are hidden so well. They're very good at leaving things out for you to find. Let's see. 
What are you? Hello? Stink animal? Fire stinking. Oh my god, this is just Clyde the fire starting cougar. Bro, cut that out. Bro, cut that out. You want to stay in the comic. Nothing is safe about this fire. Nothing is controlled about this burn. What's over this way? I've not been this way. I don't think I have. Reception area. Oh god, Goth Press, I don't want to think about Archviles. I don't want to think about the bastards of the earth. Egg! Condor egg. Condor egg. The rare and beautiful condor egg. Condors were once plentiful in this valley, but their numbers have des been decimated by modern hazards such as power lines, telekinetic grizzly bears, and poachers stealing the eggs out of their nests. Sure is a shame how they're, you know, an endangered species that needs to be critically watched and monitored to make sure they're safe. Fun scavenger hunt, though. <laughs> Nothing to do here! Ah, oh, come on! Bro, come on! Cut that out! I'm ten! There we go. Gotta use that invis. Health, please? I would like some health, please. Yippee! I would like to leave. I would like to leave. Bro, they just got bears in the caves. That's messed up. Someone could get hurt trying to rail grind in here. I do feel a little bad. I like bears. <laughs> I don't like having to hurt bears in video games. No, no, the rail! I was grinding that. Just the device up here in the main large store. Why don't you come on up and score yourself a cobweb dust before they're all sold out? Well, I suppose it's good we can just do this then. I'm not touching the left control stick, by the way. Uh -oh. This is just happening. This is just happening. bounce around a bit more in the overworld here and then call it a night. I think where where we've left off is a pretty good place to leave off, as it were. Yep. 
cherry wood pipe. Is that part of the scavenger hunt? Yes, it is. This style of pipe was common among more fashion-conscious loggers in the early part of the century, until a high frequency of logger-initiated forest fires led to a mandatory industry-wide switch to chewing tobacco, and later, bark-flavored chewing gum. <laughs> That's fun. That's cute. Cool car. Cool tree eating a car. That looks vaguely like Coach Oleander. Not quite. God, I'm seeing meat in my dreams. I now I'm seeing Oleander in the world. Special on Dream Fluffs. You hear me, Dream Fluffs? Yeah, good for you. Keep a pocket full of these for a quick boost of mental health. Maybe I should have bought some Dream Fluffs. I am suffering from mental health right now. Uh, give me cards. Give me cards. Level up. Thirty-eight. Damn, we're close. Okay. Psychonauts has nine point nine K lines of dialogue, eight point three K of which are voiced, and one point nine K of which are voiced by Raz. Psychonauts two has like double that. Oh, fun. Interesting. Two's gonna be a fun one, I have a feeling. Given how they're like charging and releasing it as like a full, like priced eighty dollar AAA video game, like I feel like it's gonna be a hefty game. I feel like it's gonna be a meaty one, and that's exciting. Let me up, okay? Probably going about this from the wrong angle. There we go, try from here. It's 25 gigs? They managed to fit a game with like 19,000 lines of dialogue almost in like 25 gigs? Wow. I don't know if it says more about uh, their ability to compress stuff, or it says Remember more about the size of other AAA games nowadays, but man. That rules, actually. Sekiro is 25 gigs? Awesome! I'm just used to, like, big-name games nowadays just, like, being super fucking bloated. Uh, I saw someone say that Psychonauts 2 is gonna be $60. Not if you live in Canada. Not if you live where I live. It is $80 before tax. It is $80 before taxes, where I live. <laughs> Welcome to Canada. Every single game that is $60 in the United States is $80 here. Uh, and I live in a province with one of the highest tax rates, so uh, it is even more expensive here. Dinosaur butt. That's where dinosaurs live. Or lived, I guess. Enormous, carnivorous, and psychically mutated. One thing for sure you can say about the valley's prehistoric inhabitants, we are glad they're dead. Nobody wants to see levitating velociraptors. Scary. <laughs> I thought you might say something like that, Puzz. <laughs> yep. Oh, hey, bud. I should switch back on over to uh, Marksmanship. 
Come on, health, health, health. Health. I love to have healing. I love to not die. Yeah, I've heard the, the, the Double Fine playthrough of Psychonauts 1 was fun. Uh, I want to give that a look-see once I'm, you know, done with the game myself. A big door you can't open. Hmm, an eager one. Eager to learn, I wonder, or just eager to play? Sir, I am here to learn, sir. You're here to train hard? Mm. Yes, sir. Develop a skill? Yes, sir. To become part of a noble team? Uh, yes. Yes. To become? Yes. A janitor! Yes! No! What? I'm here to be a psychonaut. Nah, nah, psh. Uh, the brainy jub jub goes on upstairs. And down here it's pushing brooms, not spending spoons. <laughs> no, I haven't gone back for the sandwich yet, but I imagine I can get it now that I've got uh, pyrokinesis. Mr. Crowley, there's a big mess you gotta help me clean up. Really? Where? I'll get the jet. People are missing. Kids' brains have been stolen. Coach Oleander is trying to take over the world. Ops, not my kind of mess. Won't you help? I'm a janitor. Let me know when somebody drops a carton of eggs or something. It is funny that, you know, we played Chicory, which is a game about being a janitor, and now we're, we're playing Psychonauts, which is also on, on, on pace to become a game about being a janitor. It keeps happening. I think janitors don't get nearly enough respect. But chat, you make sure that you're being good to the people that keep your spaces clean, okay? Janitors are braver than the troops. You're you're completely right. There we go. Get you with the big bopper. Hey, come on, I was invisible. Psychic bees? Fertility idol. Uh. Why was that in a beehive? Why was wasps love fertility idols? Everyone knows it. No one knows why. <laughs> But it must work because look at how many of them there are. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's that famous thing that everyone's always knowing and saying about wasps. <laughs> sure. This game rules. Women are always saying this is the thing. I'm always saying this. Yep. Yep. Here we are, the barking lot. Oh god, there's more bears! No, 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 no! Man. Come on! <laughs> I hate it, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it, I hate it here.
We need to leave. It's really death clues. Oh, okay, so those don't die in one hit of that. I thought they did. Well, that was a fun death sound, at least. <laughs> well, that time it got him. Unless damage carries over from when you die. I don't know. Well, good news, we're at full health now, so... Also, I think we can buy the, 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 the cobweb duster now, can't we? Hey, anything new in the store? Take a look! Whoa, that's my last cobweb duster! That's it for now! Okay. Take... Whoa, that... Now was that? Whoa, that's hey, my last cobweb that duster! Tab? Ah, sorry, Mac. No can't ah, do it. Ah, Never mind. Hard, cold, titanium arrowheads here. If you don't have enough, why don't you run around the outside mental health and dig some up, or crack open some mental vaults? Kind of want or this, actually. Valuable in a vault. Take it. Alrighty then. Useful psychic energy will automatically be drawn towards you from a distance. What else can I do you for? Now, you take that. Mm, now. You take that side core there, Let's buy put it together, yes. sold to the big-headed kid with the gloves. What else can I do you for? I'll take it. Sold to the big-headed kid with the gloves. What else can I do you for? That's it for now. All right, go get more airheads and come on back. This is my favorite episode. See all the campers are doing. The ones in their bunks, right? No? I thought they would be. Huh. No one's sleeping yet. All the kids have disappeared. Hmm. This is probably fine, right? This is probably no problems, right? This is totally no issues, right? Turkey sandwich. Possibly the most famous of all poultry-based sandwiches, second only to its more glamorous sister, the chicken salad sandwich. The turkey sandwich holds a special place in the hearts of food lovers everywhere who crave something that's like chicken, but not. Nice. We can just bounding ball our way past this. Whee, whee. Yep. Do we remember where the sandwich was on the list? Yeah, it was like, uh, what? That's like 14. Do not speak his name here. 
Head on over to the... Where's the area that we have to go to? Or maybe I just call it here, actually, and then next time we can head on our way over there. If you don't know what that means, you're free of the curse and you can live your life uh, without the burden of it. If you know what it means, suffer with me. <laughs> Let's save our game. We're not allowed to bring him into my streams. His name is banned here for a reason. Exit to desktop. And that's a Psychonauts for today. fun. Hope y'all enjoyed. Uh, this is 3D platformers. I mean, platformers in general, but I feel like especially 3D platformers are like uh, basically one of my favorite genres of video game ever. So this is like this is like a meal to me. This is like nourishment to me playing this video game. Uh, and I am I am fucking feasting and I am having a grand old time with this. I am very excited to play more. This is the kind of game where like if I had had these systems when I was a kid, like the systems that it was released on and I knew it was a platformer, I like I would have bought this day one. I would have bought this day one and like never stopped playing it. <laughs> Game is good. Game is good. We got a couple of achievements too, didn't we? Mostly just like story progress stuff. Get rank 20, do Sasha's stuff, do, do, do Mia's stuff. Uncover the secret of the burning. <laughs> I'm excited to play more next week. Let's see uh, if there's any fan art to show off for today. There is, hell yeah. Let's get uh, the view up. Let's get some music. Sure, let's go with this. Let's get started. Uh, starting with this really fucking good one from Phantom Miles. <laughs> Welcome to my Minecraft Let's Play. Valley. Very cute, very cute. Thank you very much. Got this one here from MLM11. He says, Working on better things, so I'm a bit busy. Proud to say my brain is focusing on psychonauts at rapid speeds. Hey, hell yeah. <laughs> We're all traumatized, kiddo. Let's get you some telekinesis. Remember, Raz, no one makes it out of this life alive. You want to set some shit on fire? These are wonderful. You have a very cool style. Very expressive. Also, I like the, like, psychic power coming off the fist here. That's a cool thing. Thank you very much. This one here from Zoobob. <laughs> okay, Raz. Let's get you to crack a barrel. <laughs> Okay, 
Okay, you learned a valuable lesson today. Now let's take you to Chuck E. Cheese. <laughs> Hell yeah. This one here from Benjamin, who says, Drew the boy himself. And that's the good shit you do love to see. I really like the colors he did on this, especially for, like, the face. Very cool. Also, yeah, the hair curls are really good, too. I used to think, uh, just going off of, like, pictures and screenshots that I had seen, uh, that Rasputin was bald because all of his hair is hidden under the hat. But that's not true. He's got hair. Thank you very much. But these ones here from Ruby. So now you're gonna give me a whole speech for this, like, like a lesson or something like that, right? No. You take this and get the fuck out. <laughs> Thank you. God, I love that moment. We got this one here from Dell, who says, I enjoy drawing in the Psychonaut style, so here's a holly and a baby. Oh, hell yeah! Oh, this is real cute. I like this a lot. And the little bird. Oh, I do like the way animals look in in the the art style of this game. This is this is really cute. Thank you. This image has so shapes in it. Such good shapes in it. I said so shapes. That that doesn't mean anything. <laughs> ah, we got this one here from Faithful the Bugs. <laughs> Space Channel. <laughs> This is gonna haunt me until the end of my days. <laughs> At the very least, I can say with complete confidence and a clear conscience that uh, this is the best drawing of of Doug Walker I've seen all year, maybe ever. Hopefully. <laughs> Thank you for this, I think. <laughs> Do always love to see your art bugs. <laughs> we got this one here from Ace, who says I couldn't get this mental image out of my hell, my head. Damn, bitch, you need therapy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Another one here from Dell, who says in addition to my prior art. I made a Psychonauts ID card for Holly, based on the actual PN2 agent IDs that were shown during marketing stuff. Hell yeah. Height, tall, and small. That's cute. Oh, I like that because the bird is included. Oh! <laughs> Thank you. Also, yeah, Puzz, I do like just the look of like... I mean, you're right, I do need therapy, but I mean, we're here to talk about shooting beams out of your hands. <laughs> we got this one here from Buggle. Leap, bounce, balance, and jump! This image makes me so happy that I will jump and scream and play. This is adorable. Oh! <laughs> Bugs art always makes me very happy. Thank you so much. Another one here from MLM Lemon. Love Sasha's flat tone, and also I can't stop thinking about this. <laughs> and what if you, uh, accidentally lock off all of your sensors? Rasputin's place is going to fucking explode. <laughs> Bro, it's going to fucking blow up like a volcano. Why do you ask? <laughs> Thank you. Got some here from Ruby. Just talking about the family curse. Going on about the curse. No, bro, the monster! The sea monster that eats your brain! Up. <laughs> Thank you. Got this one here from Mix Valley. It's a little Holly pixel art. Cute. 
Oh, this is real cute. Hell yeah, thank you. This one doesn't load, which is unfortunate, uh, but I imagine it was just a bigger version of this one, so thank you very much. Oh shit, we got another one from Bug! <laughs> Demon jump and play! <laughs> is it? Oh my god, Mickey, do I, have I started playing or saying, oh, this is gonna make me X and play because of you? Did you make me start doing that? Did I get that from you? Is that a thing you've been saying recently? <laughs> I feel like that's... <laughs> because I've been saying it lately and I can't stop. <laughs> also, this is wonderful. Hell yeah. Thank you very much. Got another one here. Uh, from... Hang on. Don't... message. There's this, there's been a breach. <laughs> Thank you, T8 Soup, or Sovp, who says, this is all I can muster out of my mind, and I think it's pretty funny. just have a shirt that says fart joke on it. I firmly believe this with all my heart. <laughs> oh, this rules. Thank you. We got this one here from Original Name. Hell yeah. Cute Raz. Thank you very much. That'll do it for the Discord. Let's see if there's any on... Twitter. Quick, give it a quick look. We got at least a couple, it looks like. Oh, we got at least a couple, it looks like. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> hang on, hang on. Also, thank you, Fizzgig, for the 12 month resub. Good night, Sionic Warriors. <laughs> The psionic warriors are training so hard to excavate every boo-boo bear they find. Thank you for the resub, I appreciate it. Let me get that browser view up. Wait just a sec. There we go. We got this one here, uh, from Butler Kitty, who says, Holly learned levitation ball today! God, I love the, like, the lighting here, like, the way, like, the... The beams are like glowing, and the, the the light emanating off the ball, and the like the the bits of like the the highlighted outline around the around the figure. God, this is so cool! This is so cool! Thank you so much. And I believe our final fan art of the day. We've got this one here from King Saber. <laughs> It's me and my friend teleport options enjoying dinner. <laughs> this fucking rules. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, I'll do one last check to see if there's anything on the Discord. So it looks like we're done with fan art for tonight. Thank you all very much for all the nice pictures. Always makes me so happy to see. I am a lot more tired than I thought I would be. Uh, so I guess it's good that I'm wrapping up now. Um, no streams tomorrow and Friday. Unless I've got, like, a moment very late at night and I want to do a puzzle game or something. Um, I'm gonna go work on some stuff to prep for, uh, Sludge. Uh, I'm gonna go work on unfucking my sleep schedule. I'm gonna work out. 
Uh, and then, you know, some other stuff, like, you know, boring adult stuff that one has to do to, 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 to stay alive and all that. <laughs> I can talk about the interesting stuff, and, at the very least. Uh, and then, Sunday, you know, morning, afternoon, around the normal Picross time. Do a bit of Picross. Uh, Sunday won't be a long stream. Just because Sunday might end up being a busy day for me. Uh, it's a special day. Um, and... Is that all I want to say? I think that's it. Who's live right now? Who's live right now? A lot of people are live right now. Hmm. It's been a while since we ra raided Wayne, and I know he's got like a million viewers, but like, you can go look at his dog. I was like, I was sad that he announced his stream during when I was going to be streaming, because it was like, but I want to look at the dog too. <laughs> Wayne was just going to raid you and we told him you were... Ah, okay. Well... What if we did it anyways as a joke? What if we did it anyways as a joke? What if we did it anyways as a joke? Oh, he's like, actually stop streaming. Okay. It's not even showing up as an option for me. Oh, well. Um... Hmm. Hmm. Um... Well, who else can we raid? Well, who else can we raid? Uh, um, I can't think of nothing. I think I might just show folks on over to Shrimps again. <laughs> Wait, no, is Goof live? Is Goof live? Let's do that. Let's do that. What's a good raid phrase? What's a good raid phrase? What's a good raid phrase? Fart joke? Fart joke works. Or, okay, uh, you have two options. Here's your options. You have... Fart joke? Or... Teleport options. Pick your favorite. Uh, let's get that raid rolling. <clears throat> Thank you all again for making the stream a real fun one. Thank you for all the subs, all the tips, all the bits. Uh, your generosity means a whole lot to me. Thank you for all the follows, all the raids and hosts that we had. Apologies for having alerts muted for a fair bit of it. It's just, you know, it's a lot to deal with, with alert sounds and also trying to listen to dialogue. I, I, I hope you understand. I hope folks aren't a little too upset about that. Uh, thank you again for all the beautiful fan art we had. And thank you all so much for tuning in, you know, whether you're only here for a bit, uh, or you were here for the whole stream. It's always a delight to have you here. Thank you so much for taking time out of your busy day to spend it here with us. Uh, I'm gonna let the scary music play instead of playing the normal goodbye music, because the idea of having a scary goodbye is funny to me. Hang on, we're not having technical difficulties. Okay, uh...
Okay, bye.